Ooh, hello. Howdy. <laughs> I know I, I know I go on about it a lot, but oh, geez, it's a bit chilly. I said I said a bit of a just rested my eyes a bit between work and jumping on this and cold man howdy <laughs> cool. Cobbs here with another red dead rp stream as george hughes on the diablo rp server <laughs> hey hammer hey cold man <laughs> i'm just i'm so damn cold man <laughs> i'm gonna die no yeah, i'm right i'm all right Hope you're well. Um, what was I doing in this? That's right. That's right. Went and the last time I was on. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. Went and um, was speaking to Shuba and Cynthia. Um, and then that's right. Stopped to talk to a couple of dudes. Just to check they're all right. And then straight away they're like. I like the look of your gun. I'm going to take it. It's like, okay. All right, I guess this is happening. They stole my shotgun. I remember. That's right. I was like, what am I doing again? It's like, oh, mate, that, 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 that RP, man, that blue, that, that, oh, man. That was, um, riveting stuff. <laughs> The hell's that? Oh, real estate. Okay. Oh, dude, I just, you know, I, I, I was like, damn, this is how you do it. Why? You don't beat around the bush. <laughs> that was a bit weird. I, I was like, okay. It's like. I think, it's like, I think it was like the second or third thing they said. And I, I've got a lasso th thrown at me. I was like, geez, he's not marking around, are we? So let's get to it. Oh, great deer of the forest. Oh, goodbye. But yeah, 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 that was, I don't know, I, <laughs> the fuck, the fuck, <laughs> that hunting or Let's take a peek. Ah! Did you get it? Was that just a deer or was that a person? Oh, shit. Hello? Hello? I can't hear you. Howdy. Hey, you all right? Was that a deer? Yeah. Okay. That's just an elk. See it right here? Right, okay. Just start me as all. All right. Hey, quick question for you. Yep. Is there a fire around here I can make some food? Uh, in strawberry? Not that I know of. I, I If I got to do any cooking of my own, I used to got to do it up in Valentine. All right. Thank you kindly, sir. Yeah, it's a pain. But yeah, good luck. It's like, please just answer my question. I don't want to blow you away. The... Stopping us on, how you going? It's like, I'm gonna steal your gun. Like, fuck off. 
piss off, mate. Okay, let's get back to Blackwater. Let's get changed. Let's go on duty. Let's try and, I don't know, try and do some sheriffing, whatever that fucking looks like. <laughs> I still need to have more sit downs with other lawmen, just ask them, you know, what do you like? What don't you like? How you going? I need to be doing more of that this week. Um, Wolf and I spoke about uh, how we think the pay should be over the next month. Uh, Wolf checked his old notes about what colour he reckons ties should be for certain ranks. So, you know, baby steps. <laughs> Crime is fine if it's done right. <laughs> I just want to, I'm just, it's, I'm like, I want to start getting everyone on the same page and just t talking through, like, the principles of being a good lawman and, like, what it means to be a lawman on a sh server like this, but in, a, like, a RP kind of way. But then I'm also being mindful of, like, there might be some more recruits coming through and people coming back from things. So it's like, do I do, like, a sit down with some people um, now and then again later in the week or next week or do I wait or it's just I'd like to get as many in one go as possible just because sometimes I hate repeating myself communication is key like that's that's a big thing I want to get across with that it's like I don't it's not like I want to be over the shoulder of every fucking deputy but it's like, got to be on the same page of what's right and what's wrong and what's expected so that I can trust you. And then you're off just, you can be mostly autonomous, but it's just any big decisions or plans and that, you just have to bring it to my attention first. I don't mean that. So it's like, you got to tell me everything just so I can be like, nah, that's dumb. Don't do it. It's, uh, I need to be, ah! I need to be aware of it. Just in case, because if it's a surprise later and it's a bad thing, that doesn't look good and I get this, I can't help you. I just want to make their lives easier. And I can't help you if I don't know what's happened. Yeah, I just need to get to that point with them so it's like they can just go do their thing and I don't have to worry about it. I know they're doing the right thing. I don't want to have to be breathing down people's necks because that is no way to work. I hate, I hate that. Yo, essential. How you doing, Bonner? And that's, and that's, that's very much what, that's right, Hammond, that's what Wolf taught all of us back in the day and Marshall Ford and all that. That's what they taught us so that we could just operate and do stuff without issue. And generally we knew all the right calls to be making, but then it's just, if there was anything out of the ordinary, yeah, you bring it to the sheriff or Marshall's attention so that you could, oh, so you are across it. Just, just see a bit of communication. Oh, my hands are so cold. Like, it's like, I gotta focus on typing. All right, who's around? Oh, fuck. Okay, it's quiet. I thought there'd be more people by now. Oh, good. The, um, the pay's been changed. Excellent. Uh, Todd Woodman signed on 10 minutes ago. All right, Woodman is around. <laughs> I thought there'd be more people by now, but it's just Hughes and Woodman. I've already had my sit down with Woodman. 
Um... Um, what do I need? What can I be doing in the meantime? What can I be doing? Oh, I got one, two, three. Look at that. Um, I need to check telegrams because yeah, I took yesterday off. I was like, nah, I'm on Sunday off. I'm not playing RP at all. And I played some, um, new on game pass was, um, is, um, uh, what's it called? Journey to the Journey to the Savage World or Planet or something, which I saw at co-op. So I was like, "Oh, screw it!" So I was like, "I let my dad know." I was like, "Let's let's try this out co-op." So we played a bunch of that on Sunday. It's a neat little game. It's like cool, like exploration puzzle, funny sci-fi game. So that was fun. <laughs> but yeah, Sunday I was like, "Nope, I am not doing any RP at all. I don't want to." Oh, I need to get some money from the bank because then I need to go get the um the sheriff colored tie. And then I also need to if Zane Ryder's around, I need to give him 25 bucks for his time at the boxing like I said I would. Hey, you take things any easier and they'll lock you up for theft. Oh yeah, uh, law badge. Have a lovely evening. What that'll do? How have you been lately? Whatever. Well, that's I'm gonna go for food. So I got a bunch of apple lemon soup. Oh no, I need. I definitely need some food. I think my frontier fillets may have been stolen. So I've still got my knife. Yeah, I think my frontier fillets may have been stolen as well. I can't remember. Which one's better? I'm assuming they're there. My hands. My poor hands. Yay, I can access telegrams. Alive! Dear George, as of 10.20pm, I'm alive. When was this? Yesterday. Jeb was found and has undergone surgery. We never made it up, up the mountain. Someone else found him first. I'm well. Yours truly, Cynthia. Oh, jeez. See, yeah, I was lurking in a bunch of streams last night just to show my support. And I saw bits and pieces. So, I know that. And now George Hughes kind of knows that. I think I have to be careful with... Like, as you should, like, how many... How many streams I watch. Because I get... Like, sometimes I'll watch just a bit here and there of... You know, one of the streamers on the server. And I'll be like, oh yeah, this is cool just to see something else. But then I'm like, what if... Like, I just don't want any of it to accidentally... Get stuck in my head, and then I, and then it's like I'm crossing the streams. I'm like, I don't know. Did I? Do I know that? Does Ch does Hughes know that? And like, I don't want to, I don't want it to affect, like, I don't want to be thinking 
Like, I don't want it to affect me when I'm, like, riding out on patrol and it to influence me where I'm like, well, I have to check there now because I got more of a hint that they could be there or or in my head it's like, oh, got to avoid there because, you know, I saw that on a stream. Like, I want it to be as natural and organic as possible. Like, I hate... I fucking hate all the metagaming, power gaming bullshit. People fucking messaging each other like... Oh, such and such is here, and this is happening. It's like, fuck off. Don't go play Red Dot Online, you fuck. It's, you're defeating the purpose of an RP server, not only for yourself, but everyone else around you. Go fuck yourself. Yo, Tom Loy. Dinger here. <laughs> hey, go, man. What are you up to now? What's your streak, man? Um, what did... Marcus Wolf, what did he say? He said that, um, neckwear, well, necktie, it is, what do you say, rack three, and then for the sheriffs, it is ten. Oh, yep, so ten for, so I said for, for, for captains, it's five, oh, yeah. Four for corporals. Three for senior deputy. Oh, yeah. And I think, I think he said that, um, uh, just deputies would just be a plain black tie, I believe he said. Cool. All right, we need to, need to clean some of this shit up. Yeah, that'll do. Oh, it's my hands, man. My hands are so cold. Is it still Woodman? Woodman's somewhere. Woodman is somewhere. Um... Oh, what just came up? What just popped up on the screen? Got 
Gotta make sure I'm not missing, um... <clears throat> let's just see if, let's see if there's anyone over in Worth a check. Oh, yeah. It's weird. Once you do sh sheriff desk stuff, you gotta do that again. It hides a bunch of stuff. Alright, let's, let's check. What's the, what is the price of an average pump action shotgun? Let's get, let's get that in my head and then I'll head out. On the usual patrol route, I think. Even just to have that presence around the west, hopefully deter some stuff or at least observe and report. You know, doing your job. Hey Marge, the rains are here! Evening twerk. Lovely day for it. Dude, it is it is pouring in-game and IRL for me. <laughs> and my hands are so cold. How you doing? Double barrel shotgun is 90 bucks. Does this place have does someone own this? Does someone have like Is there like a custom thing you can go to? I think a pump action's like a hundred and something. So the agenda today, so if I can get a hold of some West Law, I need to give them a heads up about people getting robbed around, um, uh, whatever that station is across the bridge. Um, they also need to be investigating the, uh, Strawberry Blacksmith. If I can't get a hold of them, like, they need to, just whenever they pass through, just need to see if they can find them about the way they're selling gold painting licenses and handing out um, handcuffs that they're, they're crafting. And then they also need to be looking into, they need to be questioning uh, a Harriet who is putting up flyers about George Hughes allowing there to be one free crime. That need, I need to be, I need to be issuing that to whatever West law I can find tonight. As well as, if I can, having some more sit-downs with them individually. To find out their wants and needs. Because everyone's, everyone's, everyone's unique. Well, I hope you, I hope you are warmer than I am, twerk. <laughs> by, by, like, reaching over to the keyboard to type stuff, I'm like, <laughs> I'll be all right though. I'm I'm just having a whinge. I'm just having a little bit of a whinge, but I'll, I'll be all right. I'll be all right. I I say that. I say I'll be all right, and the next thing there'll be a wagon zooming around the corner up here. Oh, I missed the coast. I've been living um I've been living pretty far inland. Rurally for the last uh, just over two years now. So over it. 
I miss I miss being within like an hour or two of the coast. Not that not 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 that I'm like a surfer dude or anything. Far from it. Or not that I go to the beach in that very often, but I just like I like having the option there. Like it is really nice just being able to go to the beach, have a bit of a swim. It just it just feels good, man. And just you know the water's there. You just you, I don't know. I just like it. You're like, well, that's there's the edge. <laughs> there's the edge of the country. I know what's up. <laughs> you know what I mean. Why is no one ever here? Yo, Cuzbot. Oh, seven stream streak. Thank you, mate. The big K dog. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thank you, dude. Hope you're well. The old. Oh, for fuck. Is it that hunter again? Whoa! Hello? What's up, George? How are you? Good, I think. Did you hear those shots? Yeah, that's what I was running. I was confused. Where the, where the hell is that coming from? I don't know. I thought it was by the stable. Uh, there was a, I was here earlier and there was a hunter shooting outside of town. I'm wondering, are they sh oh. No, it sounds like they're shooting. Oh, right there. Oh, my God. Oh, Daddy's just kidding. Whoa. Hey, partners, was those shots just hunting? Hey, um... These wolves. Gotta... Wolves this close to town? Jesus. Okay, as long as it's sorted. Double barrel. I need to check out a telegram. I don't like the one here. Kawaii guns. Pump shotgun, 130. Right, I'll keep that in mind. I called a cars, but I just I felt like there was gonna be another wagon incident. Um, I can meet you in Val if you want. Yeah, I I can meet you there if you want. You don't have to come, but I can see. Okay, see you soon. Oh wait, no, I need to I need to find the um. I need to see if the blacksmith's in. I think I'm gonna go easy on reminding people that no speeding in town and no long arms in town. Like, we're not asking much, but I think I'm gonna go easy with that until we get lots of numbers and then we're just gonna go really hard with it and then it'll be like, well, you had plenty of warnings, fuckos. Like, enjoy it while you can and then we're just gonna be f fucking fining and confiscating everything. Like, why? But why? Gee, I don't know. Maybe it's because you're dressed up like as if the British are gonna fucking walk back into town. In the middle of a street. And these would be the same people in real life that are like, but why am I getting told off for speeding? So, I don't know, maybe because it's a, a, a law just to, that keeps people safe. I don't know. Just... I don't know. Just a thought, you know. 
You know, it's like the way people look left and right before crossing the road. Yo, Toadfish. <laughs> I just, it's just, just take your long arms off when you get back in it, as you're coming back into town. And then as you're leaving town, put them back on. It's just in towns, man. Not asking much. And as we've seen, because then people can have misunderstandings and they blow each other away. It's like we literally had two groups the other day where they were both concerned about the other and then it escalated and they both blew each other to hell. And it's much easier for doctors and people to deal with if they're just using sidearms. But if they're using shotguns and rolling blocks and shit, it could quickly get out of hand. But, yeah, it's... Hurting cats, man. Hurting cats. This is why I don't have kids. Thank you for the lurk, Saint. Hope you're having a wonderful session. Hope it's a, a magical Morning, play of role. And I think my heater has warmed up the room a bit more. To the point where it's, I think it's starting to dry up my eyes. So I'm going to turn it off now. Thank you for the lurk, Cuzbot. Almost finished work. Nice to hear, man. That would feel good. Hope you have a. Hope you've got a good night ahead of you. That's right, essentially. Yeah, and then you, explosive ammo. It's just, it can quickly get out of hand, and it's just this. And I get it. Some people are like, "Well, if the law did their job," and I, I get that. Like, the sad reality is that there's not many lawmen at the moment on both sides, and the numbers are spread very thin. So I get it. But I am. We are trying to get more numbers of people trained coming up into the ranks, train them up, and then it's a matter of getting through to all the recruits, like all the lawmen, that we always need to have a presence in the West, particularly Blackwater and a patrol going between Strawberry, Valentine, and Emerald Ranch. We, because then when things stabilize, the East will have stable numbers as well. They will always have a presence in the east. Hopefully always at least two people in St. Denis and then another group bouncing between like Ansberg and uh, Rhodes and whatnot so that we are around to deal with conflict. And then hopefully there is, there is less lawmen traveling across the country to patrol in the opposite jurisdiction. You are not being paid to be an East lawman. Your job <laughs> is West lawman. <laughs> Am I going mad? <laughs> My God. <laughs> you should not. And like, if there's an incident over in the East, they need more people. That's fair enough. But you don't need to send everyone. <laughs> you need to keep at least, ideally, two people back at home. <laughs> Are you stupid? <laughs> we plugged this hole, sir. Yes, but you opened the door and you let in the floodwaters. Sleep well tonight. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Yo, Steampunk, never work with children or animals. So which group do these gun Tony thugs belong to? Uh, I think it's a mix. Well, yeah, Toadfish, it's like, it, cause in real life, like it's, um, I imagine it can be tiring and uncomfortable to carry around like two rifles on your back all the time. Like, yeah, in a lot of movies and, like, West, like, movies and stuff, they'll have their sidearm, and then when shit hits the fan, they'll run to their horse, or they'll run to the shelf, or whatever, and they'll grab their rifle. Like, they're not, not everyone's walking around like they're fucking Rambo, ready to go every minute of the day. It's, yeah, some people don't get it. They don't get it. And it's like, I, there's only so much you can do and say.
It's like, whatever, man. And that, and that is completely fine, Oliver. Like, the Rangers... Like, if it is if it is quiet in New Austin, I have no problem with them coming up. But we need... We need the stability in the West and the East, which is the foundation of the county. Like, that needs to become a thing. I don't want to fire people, but if people don't get it and they keep mucking up, I will have to fire people. I'd rather not! Please don't make me fire you! <laughs> Can you please just do your job? <laughs> Where's the yeast? Yeast, they're not in the east, they're in the weast. <laughs> Howdy, Looper. Howdy, partner. Howdy, Zozo. Oh, only if they're good animals, Zozo. That's right, Toadfish. Even in the single-player game, they will automatically put their rifles in the saddlebag, like, any chance they get. Because I imagine it's fucking uncomfortable having this big hunk of metal bang against your back while you're galloping around all day. That's right, Steampunk. And then you always think, like, the movies and that, like, sure, there's the odd shootout. But generally what comes to mind is it's always just, like, two people with revolvers settling something. Yeah, but whatever. Well, what's going on up here? I need your help. What can I do for you? It's Woodman. I know- yeah, I know that! Uh, we got three men that have all been shot after they tried to rub some folk. Jesus, just now? Yeah, 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 up here. Are you I sent out an alert, didn't you get the alert? No, how do I check them? Uh, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Is it check alerts? Or is Something it like lore that. alerts, but, or...? But yeah, the doctor just arrived in, so, uh... Jeez, lucky yeah. I got here when I did. Alright. Yeah. Howdy, William. Hi. Jesus. Is, is everybody okay? Who's with you, Todd? Just me. Who's the other fella over there? What fella? Oh, that's the, uh, guy from the uh, East Department. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Is but there anybody else on duty in the West? No. I'm gonna need to put some pain relieving on this. This room the whole dress up as Tuesday. Oh, I, I thought I thought that looked good. Oh yeah. <laughs> Howdy partner. Howdy, how's it going? Oh It's going alright. Look, I'm really glad you're here to help out my, my boy Woodman here. He's gonna feel a little weird so Appreciate that. Hey, we we isn't pressing charges on these fellas. We isn't. Oh you aren't? No, we isn't. Okay. Well I think they want we, we just wanna talk to him. Okay. We want our names. Let's keep going. All right, we'll get their names. Gonna... All right, we're going to try and ID these folks. Uh, oh, nice new tie. Uh, oh, yes. Yeah, we are implementing a... Wolf and I, we agreed on a tie colors for go. rank, so I will be okay. passing that on to uh, y'all. So with these guys, we're going to press charges, but they want to talk to them, and I want to ID these three men as well. 100%. 100%. Oh, oh go that's you? Yep. All right. Uh, oh. If, if, you, if you need help, give us a phone call, okay? Shit. Yeah, yeah. How, how many people are you looking at tonight in the east? Uh, we have two right now. Uh, this one's just a store robbery, um, so you should be alright. Alright, um, we'll keep an eye out. Around. Yeah, call yeah. us Call us if you really need us to pop over for a little bit. Too easy, thank you. Anytime. Alright, yeah, so uh, so the fellas across the road will have a chat to these fellas, but I want to ID these guys too. So they don't want to press charges, so we're not going to find them? No. There we go. Just we want we IDs. No okay. Charges, well, Todd? Okay. I'll follow your lead on this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm, I'm, you know, chatting to Mr. Hickey. Hello. So no, no trust. We just want to have a chat to Mr. Hickey. We want to chat to him. This around you here. Suppose, yeah, just get their names, you know. Yeah. Help. That's help really refreshing to hear on. that you just want to have a chat with them. That's, that's really good. There we go. Yeah, we just want to know what their plan was, basically. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, I'll be completely honest. Like, I, I came here to, to bring him to Mr. Gold. I, uh, right. to you guys. I wouldn't have involved you, but that's fine. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. involved now, so yeah, but, uh, do what yeah, you got to do. Help. We'll try and ID him. Um, Mr. Hughes, if they don't have IDs, we'll take him down to the uh, station. The love to hear it, Todd. Well. Sounds perfect. I'm going to get no them one up at a time and treat them as I, as I go. So, yes, uh, please. Be prepared. Yep. 
All right, but yeah, you boys are welcome to chat with him. We just want to, Todd here wants to just, yeah, get him ID'd. If they don't have IDs, we walk them down the post office. So yeah, feel right, free to feel free to help us, uh, you know, point some guns at him, get him on down there. On. There we go. Hey, space, space. What's yeah. going on? You hey, boys man. should have back and buried me in the scrub. Oh, I should have. Asked What's that? You. Yeah. I, mean, I still can if that's what you it's want. Hard to hear you. <laughs> is that you, Mr. Black? That it is, partner. All Don't right. mind taking this conversation inside. No, there you go. Fuck yourself. Get a prep Whoa. across the street. Should be rude. You should have buried me in the scrub, partner. I really should have. I'll say this again. Get out of my ear range. I'm, I'm afraid to go, sheriffs. I'm not under arrest, right? Not, not no, exactly. We, no, we Thank just want to check much. your ID real quick. Yeah, what do you want your ID for? You know who I am. Yep. Still Come want on. to check it. Why do you want to check it? Make sure you got it on you there. You know, it's a. Uh, Wait, it's is a it illegal law. not to have an ID? God damn it. Yeah, well, you know, if you fail uh, to, uh, you know, present I'll ID, keep it on, I keep it on the that. desk at home. You know? Yeah, that's I was all right. out on the trail rod and then. You know, got a bullet in the chest. Yeah, nope. I uh, just uh, we want that ID there. Yeah, well, I don't have it. Well, good thing the post office is just down the street. Yeah, exactly. Thanks, got I'll see. I'll post go office. get one. How about that? All right, Thank let's you. go take a walk down there. Uh, William, we'll All be right. right back. Take your time with the next one. We'll be back with Mr. Black. Do you want to come down as well, Mr. Hughes? Yes, I'll be able to uh, is, it, is that you, Mr. Dusty? Dusty's over there on the porch. Oh, who, who, the fellow in the light pants. What's your name again? Sorry. Darnell. Oh, no, you'll be able to help me accompany Mr. Or Mr. Hi Mr. Hickey. Yeah. Yeah. I came to bring you I'm to the gunsmith that you fucking threatened. Yeah. Nothing but a low life, two big piece of shit. One sec, sorry, Mr. Hickey. Described. You'll be able to help us escort Mr. Black down to the post brother, office first. All right, George, let's go for a walk. Come on. All right, come on down, Mr. Hickey. We can walk and talk. Walk and talk right Yeah, you're welcome to have your chat. We just, uh... Just gotta get, gotta uh, sight that ID down the post office first. Just wanna know what y'all plan was, you know, raiding the camp. Oh, we're riding the trail. What do you mean? We're, we're riding, riding the, camp. the trail, man. Did you see anyone riding the camp? I did, actually. When we got yeah. into the doors, busted open. We weren't even near the camp, we're just down the road. Well, sure, what brought you there then? You know how to ride on the trail? What brought you to the camp, is what I mean. Oh, just riding around, checking things out, you know, partner. You know, you, you know what it's like, you ride. I see George knows what it's like, you check things out when you're riding around. So, then how come when, after two of you got dropped, I told your boy, let's chat and find out why you're here? You know? Well, I was actually right there where you shot the first fella. I was behind the rock, mm -hmm. you know, eating a taco, believe it or not. Oh, oh those okay. tacos are good, ain't they? They are good behind a rock at our camp. That's kind of... We weren't at the camp, for just riding you, the train. you and I both know that we weren't at the camp. Come on, don't make this harder than it needs to be. Go back up Man. to your boys. You should have buried me. I'm going to walk with you all the way. Oh, we'll bury you if you keep talking about it. I mean... Please, out, out of town, him. please, gentlemen. Out of town. Yeah, so have some respect for the sheriff there, Mr. Hill. I, I get it. He's, you're, just, you're, just, you're just a little hot under the collar at the moment, aren't you, Mr. Hickey? I'm fine to be oh, honest. I, I, just, I just wanted to know what's going on, and I think this man's a bit upset that whatever he had planned got fucked up by my pump shotgun. Yeah. Uh, how much are these guys for these days, George? Well, I believe the first one is five dollars, but you can get duplicates okay. for I believe two or three. One should do. I'll give it to the missus, and she can look after it for me. Well, you just just keep one on your in your pocket at all times. Yeah. Yeah. It, can you get fined for not having it? You can, yeah. Shit, it, how much? Ah, oh, it's not too much, but it is a bit of a waste of time for everybody involved. It's yeah, just, okay. like, let's say a bank robbery or something has happened. We need to check everyone's IDs. We, we need to do that right yeah, then that and makes, there. That, that just makes helps. sense. That makes sense. Where do I do it over here? Uh, one of these two. Glad everyone's been cooperative. Oh, then go on. You go on? I lied to you. Let me see. Hurry up!
Oh, there we go. Shit. I'm not good at hand run. Nah, that's all right. He's a... We're, yeah, we're, we're getting spoiled by these top riders. Yeah, yeah John, look at this. John Black. Ben in ben. all its glory. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, just keep that Thank in your pocket. John, is that you? That's all we can ask. Hi, darling. How you doing? What the what hell are you, are you doing? Are you looking for this? You better. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, all right, Mr. Black. Busy. Thank you very much. Mr. Hickey, he's all yours. All right, let's go, darling. John, you want to have a chat, man? Or is that it? John, I mean, I just want to know You made your bed when you brought me here to wake me up. All right. Just, yeah. Keep it civil in town, fellas. Thank you. I brought you here to wake you up to find out some info, man. I don't. <laughs> Thank you, Looper, for the lurk. See you in country. You're the rest of the Hickey boys, right? Yeah, we were told to escort him down here to you. Yeah, he's a. Uh, Woodman. Oh, is this the next one? Yeah. yeah. Oh, good. I, I really appreciate you boys bringing him to us and uh, cooperate and helping get the RDs sorted. Yeah, it's all good. Yeah, really cooperate. Yeah, how you doing? Do. You had a big old hey, grin with him from what I remember. From what he told us, you're going around telling anyone associated with him, you're on a chopping block. Nah. Next one for ID. Just around here, please. That's you, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it again. Oh wait, no, hold up. We still gotta see that ID, partner. They're shocked they're running. Partner! Don't be going nowhere. Number two, need to see that ID. Go on, go get your ID. How many fucking sheriffs are here? Because it looks like it's you. There's... And we got three other people around, mate. There's one, but then these hickey boys are... Well, excuse me if we're a bit antsy. Well, we're, we're here to get... We want to know your names too, man. So at this at this stage... John Black, you know my name. We both... Fuck about your no. Game. I will fucking Second shoot Second fella off the horse. I wouldn't move. Are you Ooh. fucking serious? You want to do it again? Go get the ID. Go get the ID. Yep, big man right here. That's me. Big man hickey. It is pretty fucking tall. Just round here, this left side. I actually... I, I, I feel like... I'm not that tall. Don't <laughs> you let the Hickey boys blow him to hell? Yeah, just here. Yep. Then once I sight that, you, you, well, you're free to go. <laughs> Look at just the Hickey boys will be our muscle. <laughs> I'm just fucking. We will side with the Hickey boys if we have to. We, like, fuck, if it gets to the point where we turn a blind eye to the Hickey boys, as long as they're like... Hello, ma'am. Hello, handsome. Because as far as I can see, the Hickey boys are... ...less evil than John Black's crew. <laughs> we don't have a we 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 don't have a we can't do everything black and white at the moment until we get more people coming in. I don't want to dance. I just want to see your ID. You do not ask to see my ID. No, not y'all. The fellow at the counter. I'm the one offering to dance. Oh, no, 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 I'm on. I'm on the clock. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't know. I saw there were some vigilantes outside. I didn't know what was happening. I, I thought we were off the books here. Mr. Reagan, thank you very much. Yep. <laughs> you can't wait to get out of there. And the send here. Now this, hey, Mr. Hughes. this third fella, is he uh, went with the hickeys or is he with Mr. Black? He's, he's Mr. Black's son. But who's the guy at the counter? No, I ain't. I'm way too old. Are you one of the hickeys? I'm just... What? Can Who I get in there, please, sir? Yeah, yeah we're just going to get this fella's ID. So this, this is the is third that, one. Yeah, oh, this is Joseph. I have side of, yeah, John Black's ID and Don Reagan's. Okay. Or Dan Reagan's, one of the two. Oh, what's up, Joseph? Something wrong? Oh. Fantastic. Thank you so much, Joseph. You can head on your way now. Thanks for your oh, cooperation wise. today. See you later. We don't want to see you here again. We're... Okay. I, I don't know. No. What'd you say, so, old man? I, 
George said I can commit one free crime. I got told that that is oh that God. is not true at all. We I got told there was a ticket. Hello, Jojo. That told by who? It was on the notice board. Don't call me a lady. Handwritten, right? Where's um? Did it did it have a government seal or a law department seal? Um, where's Al where's Aldi? I don't think so. Did this come from my mouth or the the mouth from any of my boys? It could have come from Woodman. I don't remember. I don't Wait, listen to I, him I, much. I don't give people free crash. Let me let me pass this on to whoever you can. Those are uh, false, clear okay. as day. False. That is. Oh. <laughs> I will pass that on. I'm so sorry if I've touched a nerve. No, was, it's it's just frustrating because, yes, I, I'm not. A, I have crimes. been I have been extremely transparent that yes, I had a sit down sit down the other week with Caldern Wiles. Why can I put these? I words? had a sit down with Caldern Wiles because him, Mr. Black, and a whole bunch of their cronies, they were robbing people, robbing lawmen, left, right, and center all days. Right. Well, we're waiting for recruits to come in. We don't. We didn't have the manpower to be dealing with that. And I wanted to put it to a goddamn stop, so I wanted a temporary ceasefire. So we agreed okay. to that, and uh, you know we uh, we took down their wanted posters, but it was still if they commit crimes, they do the time. And yeah. the next thing we know, he's out there telling them that they get a free pass. We didn't agree. We we, sh we shook hands, goddamn it. We shook oh, no, goddamn I, I, hands. I believe you, sir. No, I'm I'm just saying what I was in the notice board. I, I'm just. Playing fun, funny buggers. But I don't. That, no, we're, we're going to be tearing all that down. We're going. I'm going to be sending out my boys to investigate that nonsense. Because yeah, that's not. Okay. That is not true. But what's your, you're one of the hickey boys, right? No, I'm just no. here. Who, who are you? <laughs> uh -huh. I'm David Attenborough, sir. Pleasure to meet you. Hey, oh. David. What? Uh, are you ready to go? <gasps> are we going to? I'm trying to dance with George, and I'm real close. <laughs> no. You're going to have to give me a sick. No. You you'll, you'll, no. you'll, you'll have to dance with me next time because I'm still uh, you know a little what? I'm still I, I, a little I, I, frustrated. I'm gonna keep you to that. When I see you next, I'm what? coming for my dance. You know what? You know you can tell people there's one what? free dance with George Hughes, but there is certainly no one free crime. No, I don't want one free. I want the dance. I don't want everyone oh, else. Oh, one to free have crime! It. I saw that. Can I take in my that, no, ticket? No, no, it's not. All right, we're no. no it is one subjects. completely false. No. Completely false. <laughs> no, that was Harriet playing funny buggers. That know, what, what happened with those problems. um those fellas? Did they tell you much? Uh we we just got their uh, IDs, except uh, men will get IDs, which they didn't have. That that was humbling. From wasn't it, George? And it seems the Hickey boys definitely don't want them around Valentine. Now yeah, look, they all don't like each other. There's a whole lot of you know silly buggers around the place, but the Hickey boys seem. You know, pretty good in comparison to the rest. So, yeah. Well, uh, yeah. I found out where the uh, Hickey Boys camp is as well. Really? Yeah. Yeah. One of the uh, one of the black boys just gave it up. <laughs> no, it's you. All right. Well, let's. It, it, but I'm not going to do anything with it unless uh, you know. Let's keep that in our back pocket. Yeah. But it's just we just until we get the numbers up, we just want to keep the nonsense out of towns. If these, if all these. Idiots want to go blow them each other to hell. They can go goddamn do it out in the desert. Yeah. yeah. Agreed. Agreed. Oh, we, we gotta have a uh, we gotta have a real quick chat, George. But I need you to turn off your eyes when we do. Jeez, that bad. Yeah. Okay. What well, should we go do it in the Valentine office? Uh, I'd rather go up and have a chat in the hill. Okay. Uh, is oh. is it Mr. Cole? Oh, that's me. Yeah. Is it Mr. Cole welcome? Uh, no, this, I just need to say I'll just file it to you. That's serious, I'll, huh? Uh, I'll yeah. leave you guys to it. All right, Mr. Yeah, Cole, yeah. we'll so, be so, around. Sorry, Mr. Cole. We gotta no, go up right. on the hill. Oh, you know shit's real when you're going on the hill. Giants up there. Oh, oh god damn it. Well, oh. David's gold send up front, you hear? Part? Ugh, what's gold talking about now? No, I have a care package for you guys. Oh. I, uh, well, yeah. Well, no, you got a small package, don't you? I don't know what you're packing, but I got a package from Mr. Hughes. What? Uh, remember our little meeting? Uh, yes. Yeah, the uh, goods have been delivered. Where to? Uh, near a stable. Um, I also need to find Mr. Wolf and Mr. Miles. Do we? Do I need to go get that now? Don't have to do it now. Whenever you're ready. All uh, right. Is it, is it later tonight or early tomorrow night? Okay. That's fine. Because I That's Todd really needs to talk to me privately about something. It's about your small package in the garden. All right. Well, good luck. 
Thank you, Lou. Thank you, Cole. Um, yeah, oh, we'll, yeah, we'll come back into town before we head out. All right, all right. That's all. I'll see you fellas around. Let's go. Need, give me a. So what? So what? You need me to cover my eyes and my ears? Uh, yeah, I just don't want uh, anyone listening in at all. I anyone apart moment. from me. Okay. Yeah, let, at the moment. Okay. Wink, wink. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. All right, Leah. Let, I'll let you know when I've. So eyes and ears. Uh, or just ears. Well, are you gonna be showing me something or just telling no, me no, something? No, 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 I'll just be telling you something. Okay, so I just close my ears. Like, you'll okay. whisper in my ear. Yeah, I'll, I'll be as quick as I can. Yeah, no, that's fine. I'm just, I don't wanna make, I don't wanna muck you yeah. around. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I'll, uh, I'll cut my ears, if you know what I mean. Yeah. No, it's, uh, because you, you know what things can happen with this. Yeah, yeah, people suck. Yeah, exa exa exactly, that's why it has to be this way. At the moment, anyway. All right, and then once you tell me that, then I'll uncut my ears, and then i got to give you an update on things that you can um, pass yeah. on to the other boys if I don't see them tonight, that people okay. just need to be doing in their spare time this week. All right, let, I'll cut my ears. Give me a sec. Oh, goodness. You know, it's serious. But, all right, sorry. Sorry, everyone in chat, but this is super serious. No lip reading. All right, Todd, I have cut my ears. It's just you and me. Yeah, I've been hearing a bunch of reports like that, which is concerning.
But yeah, I can't believe yeah, those those uh, donuts from the bakery. Yeah, I'm really glad you told me about all that. I've been meaning to go back and get some donuts myself. Yeah. What's your favorite flavor donut, Woodman? I, I don't know. <laughs> all right. Now, on to, th on to things I need to bring up with you. Yeah. Um, just to pass on to the others. So, when I clocked off the other uh, Saturday night, I was uh, I was actually robbed down near, uh, is it Wall Station? The one across the train bridge down near Blackwater? Oh, Flatneck. Flatneck. I was robbed of my sh pump action shotgun. They tried what? to take my bolt action rifle as well. Ooh. Two fellas. One look. One kind of looks like you. He's got the Woodman Special. Um. It, yeah. Two gentlemen that were hunters. One rode a donkey. One had a dock and a navy outfit. The other one had light pants and a mullet like yourself. Mm. Um. And yeah, they took my. The one with the mullet took my uh pump action shotgun. And yeah, tried to take my bolt action as well, but I talked him down. Okay. And uh, yeah, the other one. Yeah, he's got like. Color hair just like us, and then the other one, yeah, dark outfit, like also navy, and then he's got like a dark beard and then like dark slick back hair. Okay. So yeah, they took some money as well, but the main thing was they took my pump action shotgun, oh. which was very disappointing because I was off, I was off uh, duty, so I wasn't dressed as a sheriff, so yeah. they they didn't know who the, but they didn't wear masks. Oh. So we I see you, I can point them out to you. Yeah. So yeah, uh. Yeah, I need uh, I need the department when they when they've got free time to be investigating Flatneck, keeping an eye on there on the patrol route. Oh, yeah. The other thing is we need people to be keeping an eye out to get in touch with the Strawberry Blacksmith. They are selling uh, gold pan and licenses, which don't seem legit at all, and they're also handing out handcuffs that they're making. Well, that's illegal. We should be able to raid it then. That's yeah. We just we need to get a contact. We need to find out who the hell owns it and when they what times they operate it. So there's that, okay. and then uh, when when people go over to St. Denis and search to help out the east side, need to be tearing down these George Hughes gives out one free crime posters, and okay. we need to we need to we need to find there's some every twice now in St. Denis there's this uh, I think her name's Harriet or something she wears like oh a, yeah she's the horse lady well yeah we need to I need people to question her and get her to stop okay because of I, I suspect she's involved because twice now. The only times I've ever run into her in St. Denis, she keeps yelling out top of her lungs about one free crime. Okay. All and right. uh, it's getting ridiculous because that's not it at all. All right. So that's that's the three main objectives I have for the department this week. Okay. So, so arrest Harriet then? No, uh, question Harriet. Ask her to we stop. Okay. And uh, write a report on all that so it's documented. Keep an okay. eye on Flatneck for, for more people robbing. Yep. And uh, try and find out who the hell runs the Strawberry Blacksmith and when the hell oh, we can, can get a hold of I can find that out pretty quick, actually. Well, yeah. Pass that on to the other boys when you see fit. Yeah. Um, I'll, I'll tell well, the I others as I see I haven't seen anyone at Strawberry Blacksmith in month. Right? Yeah, but apparently, yeah, it's confusing. And then apart from that, it's the usual patrol route and whatnot. That's the usual. All right, let's get back in town. Maybe we'll see Cole. I need a, I need a, I need a, I need a bath. And then, like, you remember the way I had that sit down with you, the talk? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm trying to do that with the rest of the department this week. So, okay. I'm just. But yeah, we've organized a new pay rate. Look, I know the pay's not exactly amazing at the moment. I do want to get some the people. The other deputies are on the east side are getting double us. No, no, Wolf and I we're a. Uh... Wolf's going to be bringing it down to our, the same amount as us. Oh. Wouldn't it be better to put ours up to the same amount as them? Then everyone's happy. No, Wolf and I discussed um, the prices, and uh, we both agreed on what's currently set for us now. Okay. I know. It's just for this month. Sheriffs. Howdy. I'm mad y'all. Oh. What happened? You didn't come to my alert oh. yesterday. I wasn't. I wasn't. Did song, did this song I had to handle work? a man by myself. Oh, you'll be fine. I bet you're more and than capable. She destroyed him. Yeah. yeah, I shot him in the head. Excellent. Okay. Love to hear it. Still, nope. I feel offended. You guys didn't come. That'd be mighty sexist of, of us if we assumed you couldn't handle yourself. <laughs> I even asked for help. But well, I. I said help. Hello. 
I can't speak for the rest of my boys, but I wasn't even in county yesterday. You stalking lady. I feel offended. Any chance we get, we will come help. Is who hurt you? The sheriff. The sheriff. All right, that's it. I'm gonna do absolutely nothing. But I didn't do anything. Literally. I was. I was at church or something. I don't know. Having dinner. You know the mistake you just made you is engaging anyway? in this conversation. What? Well, mm -hmm. I, I wouldn't. Mm -hmm. have done it. It's just a constant losing battle. You can't that, win. You sorry? just can't win it. That wouldn't be very sheriff of me if I didn't okay. ask. You say malt anyway? <laughs> I was about to ask you the exact same I can't same go hide in my office uh, all the time. Uh, they're currently discussing a business. They're discussing business. Oh, okay. Business. We know where they're hiding. <laughs> Oh, no, they're not no. While I'm here, does anybody no, else no, have anything to report? Speak. Any any other concerns they want to share with the sheriff's Actually, department? Yes, I yes do. sheriff, sheriff. I've got a stalker, and I'm really disturbed by it, and I'd like them to stop. You want to talk here or go somewhere private? No, I can talk right here because she's already run off because she thinks you're about to get her. Oh, well, have you tried telling her to stop stalking you? Absolutely. Have you said please? <laughs> yep. All right. Is this That's the lady him. on the back of the horse? No, nope. the lady in the blue. <laughs> The one with the yeah, she every time she Where'd stalks she go? me. She's probably watching me with her binoculars again. I don't know. She just like ran me, off that way. Minister. I don't see I told her I'm married. Yeah, stalking, stalking ain't okay. Everyone has the right to mm -hmm. their own personal space and their own privacy. Stalked, yeah. <laughs> that worked out pretty well for me. <laughs> All right. Well, any, 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 anybody else got anything else they want to share with the the law department, just so we're aware, so we can help? I know snitch. <laughs> can you hit a snitch? <laughs> oh, sorry. Mm -hmm. I had some milk in uh, Saint Denis and it's fucking Stop. Up. Stop. Just Saint Denis. The the is a silent there, brother. Oh no. Saint Denis. Ma'am. What? Ma'am. At least he doesn't say Dennis. Ma'am, I'm gonna Correct. ask you this one time. I need you to stop stalking this gentleman right here. I have never done such a thing. Okay. You a liar. <laughs> all right. He's well, looking at me right now, look at him. Let's Wait, keep it that way, all right? Look, stop it. He, yeah. he said we keep it that way. I can look at you, you can't look at me. Just like yourself, he is entitled oh, to live a nice, a safe, weird. prosperous life without getting stalked by a pretty lady. I don't stalk okay. people. Thank God for that. You've got the wrong lady, I'm telling you. All right, just, just keep your hands to your... You. Just keep your hands to yourself. Felt temptress, keep your damn hands to yourself. Did she call him? Just walk her around. I'm telling you right now. No, you no, no, ain't around a moment. You Sorry, should be no. using your powers for good, not evil. Hey, could you come in here real quick, uh, Minister? Yeah, All right. Sure. Howdy, no Jack. All right. I need a bath. Have fun. Don't so I'm just going to leave that. I'm going to have a bath. Everyone. I'll be back. Mr. Hughes? Whoa. Who, the who was that? Oh. Where was that? Uh, over here on the horse. Oh. Jeb! I thought I recognized that voice. Yeah. Jeb, how the bloody hell are you? Oh, I'm all right. I uh, uh, don't really remember what happened over the last few days, and um, I had to have surgery. And uh, you I'm, I'm, I'm going to have a bath. Come down to the, come down to the hotel. Get, have a chat. All right. All righty. I'm just going to leave every conversation. I'm going to have a bath. <laughs> hey, actor. I ain't no snitch. <laughs> you just found, I ain't no snitch. I'm just asking if you need help. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. Just asking if you have any concerns. I'm asking you to fucking snitch. And Miss Lily, good to see you. See? You step did. Step she, off Jeb, mud. did you hear how well she did in the boxing? I did hear. <laughs> you might want to step away from the horse, though. She, well, she punched there. a man right across the fucking ring. She, oh, really? He, he did fly. We, Where? We, 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 you should have seen, heard all our reaction. We could not believe what we were seeing. <laughs> it wow, was, okay. it was fucking amazing. Wow. Okay. The best part was at the beginning, people were doubting the matchup. I was like, oh, just you wait. I'm a pretty good starter. <laughs> <laughs> she, she got us all surprised. It was amazing. It was probably the highlight of the whole event. Oh, I'm glad. So, I'm, glad. I'm, I'm sad that I missed it, but I'm glad that it went. I'm sure you already knew this, but you are in more than capable hands. <laughs> oh, well, I did know that, Mr. Hughes. You 100%. Oh, we, and we are all well aware now. But, Jeb, it is so good to see you. I've heard so much over the last few days. I was nearly yeah. a, a, going to come on an expedition with people to come up and find you in the mountains and have a chat. And, yeah, I, right. I've heard about surgery and whatnot. What's going on? 
Oh, well, so from what I understand, and maybe Miss Lily could fill in the blanks, because I'm a bit... I must admit, my memory is not so great at the moment. Uh, uh, Mr. Yuri had to cut open my head. Jeez. And, there was a little uh, bit of dead brain tissue. Which had to? In him. Oh, from um, getting shot? I think so. A bit to of a shave all my hair off, as you can ah. see. Jesus, and you feel feeling okay? See things and hear things, but uh, I don't think you're seeing and hearing things anymore. No, I, I feel great now. Well, I hope I got not. A, I got a splitting body headache, but apart from that, feeling a lot better. Yeah, yeah. I bet. Gee, well, yeah. it's just good to see you. So eventually, uh, eventually, Mr. Yuri says that uh, in about a week or so, I have to have another one where they're going to put a metal plate in my head. Oh God. So, uh, yeah, I was touching gold there for a, for a little bit, and uh, from what I understand, it's affected my memory a little bit. I've forgotten a few things. We didn't like, know I can't... if he was going to remember anything when he Oh, but you, you remember the important stuff, right? Well, Miss Lily is the most important, so I remember her. That's the main thing. Thank God. Yeah. And, uh, but I keep hearing about this Mr. Walter Gold. I don't remember him. It's and... probably for the best. <laughs> you'll, I'm sure you'll be reacquainted soon. Oh, yeah. From what I've heard, he's apparently hard oh, to Oh, sorry, miss. Jack. You, you, the, the, it, you see him? You hear him before you see him. Oh, okay, see he's him. one of those types. Okay. Yeah. And uh, oh, I heard... Oh, well, Mr. Harkness. And uh, I heard there's yeah, a, been a lot of changes to the sheriff's department while I was gone. You so, have... You have no goddamn idea. Yeah, the, yeah the, a lot of the, changes. the governor had his maiden. He appointed oh, Wolf as oh, oh, new sheriff of the east, me for the west, and I so yeah. and so Wolf and I have been having a couple of meetings, trying to get like the pays uh, the same, as well as right. uh, Wolf is uh, very high on the east. Hey, they're very high on the east. How are they? Uh, Sixty-five oh. cents or something per deputy. Really? Because oh, yeah, okay. no. Uh, yeah, that's a lot. I put into the government that the changes was for both Wolf and I, both okay. East and West. Both yeah, Wolf and I. We had to sit down. We agreed on set rates. Oh yeah, they may have changed now. Oh. Oh okay. Yeah, because I only just saw the changes happen today. So hopefully that's yeah, because we want to be on the same page with that. Uh, right. we, we had a big yeah. chat on the pros and cons. It's if after this month. May they may all go up. It's just we got to see how this next month goes. Yeah, with new recruits and stuff. And then yet Wolf found some old documents about uh, colored ties per rank. So it's a uh, like this. This one I got here is the sheriff tie, and then your okay. deputy's got the black tie. And then I think right. it goes like blue, green, red, or something. Um, okay. I'll, I'll pass that on. I'll be passing it on everyone. But we're, we're, we're yeah, lots of lots uh -huh. of stuff going on. We're doing what we can to deal with it. It's a lot. Uh, Tessa will be back. Excuse me, gentlemen. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Sorry. Um, I hear that, uh, and correct me if I'm wrong, only, as I said, I can't really remember the last five or so days, so forgive me, but I uh, heard that you, uh, Mr. Harkness and Mr. Gene, are coming over to the East. Is that right? Is that just a uh, rumor? Someone uh, just said that to moment. me today. It's yeah, I rumor. haven't heard anything. Well, I would hope you would. I've been know, helping. <laughs> Oh, it's been helping Marcus because the number's been very low. We've had more on this oh. side recently. Okay. All right. Well, yeah. I mean, I, I've been put on a week's leave. I'm going to see Mr. Mr. Wolf uh, this evening and just let him know that I am back. Maybe I can... I'm not... I've been given strict orders by the doctors to not stay in the sheriff's station. <laughs> and, uh... But maybe I can do some paperwork or something. I don't know. Yeah, uh, he's back into it. Take your yeah. time. Yeah, exactly. Health is uh, important. Uh, yeah. Well, for now, I just want to focus on, uh, you know, getting back at it, getting healthy, and then uh, eventually having this wedding. So, when are you thinking know. of having that? Uh, not sure yet. Oh, we missed. Not sure when the wedding's happened yet. But soon. Um, we haven't decided that yet. Soon-ish, I hope. I mean, with everything going... Everything going on, uh, you know. Drug deal with strawberry, interesting. Oh dear. Gosh. All right. Well, it's been great catching up with you, Jeb. But I think Sorry, dude, you duty get calls. To have your no, that's all right. I'll have one at the next stop or two. Oh, if you need a bath, George, that's fine. 
All right. So where's where's Woodman? Is he still up there? I have no idea. Oh yeah, he is. I think so. All right. See you later, Mr. Hughes. Uh, see you, Jeb. See you, Lily. Hopefully, see you see see you soon for a nice a chat. Yeah. We well, isn't talking about enough. Uh, what oh, should we do? Go to the thing? Yeah, we better. You're gonna go flex for George? Is that what you said? Go on, boys. Howdy, Sheriff. Skirts off for George. Howdy. Billy says he Rick, wants to take, it, you, it, take his shirt off for you. What? Why? It's Mr. Hughes, quick, surround him, get around oh, him. <laughs> Jack, Todd, get, you go ahead. I'll catch him. up. Quick, look, I'm here comes Darnell. Guy. Jump on him, I'm Darnell. Going with this guy. Oh, God. <laughs> Who's, Bye, which, wait, which one's Billy? <laughs> Billy wants to take his shirt off for All right, you. Darnell's gone. Hold on, which one's Billy? The one in the leather jacket. Yeah, oh, come on. on. That's yeah. That's like look, them used, you want to dance with me? I I don't have time to dance right now. I'm afraid. Yeah, well, it's kind of rude. I'm a member. Uh, who's who's George. the head hickey? We don't have no a head. Hickey. We just have a bunch of us. Well, who's the best? The most charismatic. Who's who's the best hickey to that? talk to at the moment? Me probably. All right. Sure. You, you want to jump on the back of my horse and we'll have a quick chat just down past the stables? Oh fuck. Uh oh. Oh, Darnell got one. Good job, Darnell. What, what the hell just happened? Hey, my, my brother Darnell. Oh, when you hey bleed. Darnell, come to the stables. We're gonna talk to Hughes. It's gonna pop yeah, it up. Yeah, yeah. Me, me and Darnell. Hughes in the Hickey's Hughes. chat down in the stables. Yeah. Why you got such a oh, shitty horse, Hughes? Man, you need to make some more money, get a better one. I'm trying to save all my pay. Let's go, uh, go make a withdrawal. You know. I don't have that much money. We, we don't make that much money in the in the sheriff's department. I'm not saying we draw it out of your account, man. Who the f- Oh, shit! He wants my wagon. He dead. Fucking locals! There yeah. it goes. I just paid four hundred dollars for that thing. Why'd you drive them all down? Jesus! <laughs> <laughs> enough shooting, enough shooting. <sighs> All right. All right two, hooky, two hickeys in a law, man. It All right. Like it's, you're starting to I'm, I'm horrible with names. Okay, who am I talking to? John. I'm John. John Hickey Darnell. and... Darnell Hickey. Darnell Hickey. Okay. Look. We're all, all in the West Department. I'm up, quite frankly, the East. We're getting real sick of, you know, what's left of old Caldern Wiles group and John Black's groups. They... They really rub us the wrong way. They're a bunch of them guys. Yeah, hey, fuck which man. They fucking they ro tried robbing our camp, and I put yeah. fucking shotguns into them, and we even brought. We didn't know what they originally wanted, so instead of just leaving them in the dirt, we brought them back here to talk to them, and all they did is turn around and say, "You shouldn't have left us in the dirt." Yeah, they were really you know? rude, and they were really difficult about just I, getting some ideas. I didn't realize he was him, you know. I just didn't realize. No, oh, that's them. No, that'd be nothing but trouble. And like we've tried talking to them before, and they say one thing, they do another. They just they're lying sack of shit. So, uh -huh. so look, as far as we're look, because we're we're trying to get more recruits for the law department. As far as we see, we can't talk, say for sure, but you hickey boys seem all right. So look, just just rest assured that. You know, if it comes down to it, we'd really rather, you know, have our backs against the wall with the Hickey boys dealing with these groups. Well, yeah, man. Like, like I've, you know, said to a lot of the sheriff, said to the sheriff, said to me. I don't know if I've said to Jane. I don't know if I've said to you. But at the end of the day, you know, we don't really give a fuck about, you know, drama with the other groups. We don't care. We're, we're more, you know, keen on just making a bit of coin. And maybe that'll, you know, have us cross some lines with the lawmen. But at the end of the day, it's two, it's two sides of the same coin. Y'all are doing your job. And we're just doing what we got to do to survive, you know? No, I get it. I get it. And then, then there's, like, a lot of things in life, there's a good way going go about it. And there's a bad way. And how oh, Exactly. The I'd much rather, you know, get caught. I last show and get a couple bruises, then get a bullet to the back of the head. You know what I mean? Yeah, and just I imagine the lawmen are similar. They don't now, want to die. Now you fellas ain't all about terrorizing towns, are you? No, we're not. No. Exactly right. Exactly we, right. We, we we have the belief here, and I don't give a fuck who says they own Valentine. To us, Valentine is a free free town. Anyone wants to come here, they come here. Anyone wants to do business, they do it. 
we don't own it. We will never say we own it. If somebody comes in here and says they own it, that's fine. They, they can own it. But as soon as they start kicking people out for some bullshit, well, then that's where the hickeys get involved. Vandalizing and stores and whatnot. It. It's just not. It's, yeah, it's we're not. Like, we're, like, we're like Robin Hood, you know, stuff from the rich. <laughs> yeah. and give it, give it to the poor. You know, we go into people's hoods and we rob them. That kind of shit. Look, yeah. Look, what are you boys doing? You've spare time. It's just yeah, out of town, and yeah, just. I mean, yeah, no, yeah. we don't rob people. Yeah, no, we don't rob people. Just yeah, we don't rob people. So yeah, just wanted to no. just touch base with you and just let you know that. You know, we got the West Law. We got no hard feelings against the Hickey Boys, and um, neither we are, man. I just, we, we are just belief West is best. That's that's it. It's 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 a it's got a bit of a rhyme to it, don't it? That's it, man. Okay. That's it. So just of um, yeah. You know, and I understand, like, you know, the, that that. You know, I mean, shit, I got caught and shared my time, so I think I can talk about it. But, you know, that that shit that went down the other night when um, you know, I got caught. Uh, trying to make a withdrawal. Oh, you know, I, spoke, I spoke to Harkness, and that was a, a recruit that shot me and shit. And you know, like I said, you know that that shit's gonna happen. You know, people yeah, gotta do your job. We do our job. Yeah, that's that's right. It's ne that's it's never it, personal. We're, it's, of course, we got a lot of people breathing down our necks. Yeah, I mean, not that I'm ever gonna do a bank again, <laughs> but I always say that you know, um, if I were to hypothetically do one again, you no, know, yeah, it's just fucking. Keep 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 your guns holster. We keep our guns holster, kind of thing, you know. At the end of the day, we just want everyone in the towns and farms and whatnot just to, to be safe and live their lives. And uh, exactly. just the and way the it miners is, in the county and shit, you know, they shouldn't be getting robbed. John Black boys and all that, they just yeah, they take it too far. So yeah, just just want just want to touch base. Would would either of you uh, either of you happy to uh, share your postal ID? Yeah, you can give I it to me. I can't read nor write. You can't read. I can oh. read. So you can have mine. All right. Well, mine is mine is mine is really easy to remember. It's just six. Okay, six. So it's John Hickey. Six. Yeah, John John Hickey. You ever need a? And what was the number? Sorry. Um. Uh, six thirty four. Six three four. Right. It's kind of similar to your one. I appreciate kind of, that, John. I got two extra numbers because I'm cooler. All right, fellas. Pinch. Appreciate you taking the time for that, and uh, yeah. Um, That's right, let man. me know if you hear anything that we can do to help deal with these horrible people. Yeah, look, man, we like what happened there. You know, we we yeah, we'll handle shit the way we handle shit. You'll handle shit the way you handle shit. You know, and if, if whatever we're doing crosses with whatever you're doing, then you know, like just in that keep situation. it out of towns, please, boys. Just keep it out exactly. of towns, and uh, just exactly. yeah, stand up for the little people. You know it. Oh, I know a little person. I always stand up for him. Thanks, fellas. You have a good day Thank now. I hope, hope there's no more trouble with your camp. Yeah, well, we'll find out. People, people should feel comfortable in their home. I know, right? All right, I got to head out. You, you just have a safe day. Where are you heading, Hughes? Oh, everywhere around the West. It's going to be nonstop. <laughs> hey, Mrs. Phenom. Bards are great. Bards are great. Harkness and Woodman are alright.
Valentine and Strawberry always feel really close together, but then it's always just seems that it just seems a bit long to ride between them. I don't see Todd and Jack. Have we got any else on now? No. Does this door open? I can't remember. Rub a dub dub. Oh, every time jumps up on that thing. Oh, there he is. Uh, he's all right. Uh, yeah. Uh, I need a bath, but. Oh, go for it. It's wispy or something. I think I spotted cold urn. Wait, just now? I think I did. Shit, yeah, there were three people just down in the street there, but I... Yeah, I, I... think one of them was him. Kind of looked like him from a side. Oh, you gotta be... I was acting casual because I didn't want to blow you and Woodman's yeah. cover. No, I just walked up into the department. The so I came into town. Shit. Oh, I'll wait here. Shit.
That'd feel better. Shit, yeah, not. That's better. Now you would have had a better look than I did. That's... Yeah, I could see it from the sides of Woodman's around here somewhere. Well, that group, they walked across the bridge down here. Should we or should we take a look? What do you think? How do you want yeah, to play it? Take a look. I'm not going to arrest them for anything. All right. Go to the gun shop. Buy some ammo. That's it. Yeah, it's a nice stroll down to the gun shop. Hey, fellas, um, are you able to take uh, scopes off guns? Oh, I've never, I've never owned a scope, so I wouldn't know. Sorry. Ah, that's all right. Jack, have you ever had a scoped gun? No, I've had. I've taken them off before, but you need the correct tool. I heard the the uh, the lawmen's hold the tools. Is that is that still true? Oh. I'm not 100% sure, actually. Because I, I bought a gun from someone has a scope on it. Um, <clears throat> I want to get that scope off. Oh, if, if we do, no one's told us. Ah, like no. a lot of things, but a gunsmith, surely. No, nah, I have no fucking idea. I can put I can put them on a gun, but yeah. I can't take them off. That's the thing that hey, uh, we're trying to figure out. Are you a local here in Strawberry? No. Uh, I, I own a store that you're standing in. Oh, would you happen to know the blacksmith? Uh, no, actually I haven't. I knew them before, but then they moved to Blackwater. I've not seen the story. Blackwater. How long ago did they move to Blackwater? Oh, fuck. Um... Holy... You know what? I don't know. That's alright, that's alright. We're just, just wondering. Probably, I feel like, towards the beginning. Oh, that long ago. Okay. They yeah, weren't here very long. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. You wouldn't happen to know of anyone else in Strawberry giving out gold pan and licenses, would you? Mm, no. You can buy them? Well, I... I you could. Sounds like some people were doing it illegally. You can get them illegally? Yeah. Well, Jack, Jack, how do you get one... Okay, now. Legally? There's a gold panning license? Well, that's the thing. I, I, I ran into someone the other day that okay. had a handwritten gold pan and license that cost him $80 from the Strawberry Blacksmith. They gave him permission to gold pan in this e this region. Interesting. Should I? Which does not sound right at all. Oh, wait, is that that guy down there? That's near that house? Could be. He's like down... down yeah, every there. time I go, they're oh, not there. But maybe they're one. now. Well, well, thanks thanks anyway. So you run the gun store okay. here? Yep. Okay, well, nice to meet you. George Hughes. Oh, nice to meet you, mate. Oh, actually, I'm on yeah, like... ammo. Howdy, just... Pond. Hey, George. How you going, man? Oh, I'm all right. Well, you, you wouldn't happen to know the strawberry blacksmith, would you? Uh, no, I would not. I would have no idea, to be honest. Damn it, that's all right. What are you looking for? Oh, we just want to talk to the strawberry blacksmith, if there even is one. I don't think there is, just quietly. It's confusing. Yeah, um... Well, I've, yeah, I've my blacksmith's just down mine. there. Yeah, okay. I don't know if... I haven't seen it. He could be one, but I haven't seen one here. That's it's, all right. Uh, We're just asking oh, he's around. One of those blacksmiths, is he? The yeah, local he's always yeah. in the mines. <laughs> oh, I actually don't. I've got no idea. I'm zero help here. That's about fair. the what? Blacksmith here in town. Oh yeah, he's down there. I just seen him. Actual? Yeah. Come oh, on, okay. follow me. Okay. Good luck. The elusive oh, wow. strawberry oh, blacksmith. I'm riding back to your horse as well. I got to get my shoes fixed. Oh, no problem. I call you my horse, woman. Got my head for a minute to grab something. Oh, All yeah. right. That's if we go to the town in a minute. Yeah. We will see. Hey, Todd, that guy back there behind us on the corner? Mm. Kind of looks like one of the fellas that robbed me the other day. 
kind of. Sure. He's wearing different pants and a different shirt, but that that looks very much like one of the people. Okay. The blacksmith? What? The blacksmith. Uh, you're wearing the wrong clothing for a blacksmith. Yeah, that is a horrible choice of color. Hello? Hello. Anybody here? This is this is claustrophobic. So yeah, you got this fella here, but then yeah, apparently there's a there's an actual strawberry yeah, blacksmith. Yeah, yeah, there's a you can buy your license for gold painting right there. Really? For how much? Hello, sir. Howdy, Mister. Look around. Take your time. Sixty. Well, it's a government sanctioned thing. Come on back oh, it is le so it is legit. Yeah, so if we catch someone, we can find them for not having a license. Oh, well, there you go. Okay, fuck, check check all the fucking rivers and inlets and outlets and. Oh, who whistled? That sounded. That whistle. Where did that come from? I heard a whistle. Yeah, it sounded faint. Yeah, but. Yes, yeah, Who else of us is around here? No idea. Cole? Oh, let's go for a walk. Cole might have come back. I don't think Mark's... Hopefully Mark's around tonight. Is he doing alright? He's got like one person with him there. Oh. oh yeah. Yeah, when I see Mr. Wolf, I gotta ask him something. You know, Harkness, like, I don't know what Jeb was talking about, but if you and Sledge just feel like you'd like to join the East Department, you know you can tell me, right? I just been having to think about what I want to do at the moment. That's alright. I'd, I'd welcome people transferring between the departments every yeah. now and again. Yeah, I was talking to be a temporary if I did it, just so they get on their feet properly. So they've had well, right. well, that's yeah, good. Some of the east should come over here, and some of us should go over there. and be like swapping wives. Well, it'd be good every now and again. But yeah, if, if, if anyone, good. if anyone's right. ever considering that, don't don't feel like you got to hide it from me. If you feel like you'd like to do a bit of time over in the east, no problem with me. We we'll, Wolf and I'll sort something out. That sounds fair. And yeah, I agree. Like if uh, if we if suddenly we're seeing the old switcheroo where we've got more people than the east, then I I think it's only fair that you know if people want to go help with numbers over there, that's because Wolf yeah. would do the same for us. They've uh, lost two people, I think, too. Who? I've heard Tessa. Mm. I've heard rumors about that. Tell me, Kenneth's coming back. Which one's Ken? Maybe. I know they're very upset about what happened. Look, I don't I don't blame them. That was. What about uh, Dinger? Any word on Dinger? Dinger's coming back. Uh, Dinger's on holidays. Oh, fair. And uh, He's well, back. Jeb's making a recovery. Thursday. He should be back before we know it. Yeah, first, I think Dinger's back. What he told me. He's. I suppose even the biggest of hats need a rest. Hey. Very true. <laughs> Doc and Zozo. Plus, yeah, everyone needs a break from Walter. You're too right. Oh, also Jack. I was telling, updating Todd. Um, this week's, you know, when you've got time and you're between places, here's the, the current sort of, uh, missions for you. So, uh, so before I, before I went to bed Saturday night, when I was off duty, you know, dressed in casual wear, I got robbed up near, uh, Flatneck Station. Oh, bloody hell. They took my shotgun and they took $40 from my pocket and I think my meat as well. Now, it was That's two gentlemen. Nice. One was dressed, uh, he looked like the fellow that was on the corner over there before, wearing a, like a dark outfit. A uh, dark beard, dark slick back hair, a navy shirt, that sort of look. He lassoed me very quickly. And then, howdy, That's howdy, Louisa. Good. And then Sorry, the other I'm not fella. Interrupting him out. No, no, you're all right to hear this. Um, I just got to. I'm just giving them the, the objectives of the week. So yeah, one fella just dressed like that. These are the two hunters round flat neck. The other one was kind of looked like he had the same sort of hair as Woodman, but then he sort of wore a similar coat that I wear in my spare time. Um, and he was wearing, he had light pants, and yeah, they sold me very quickly, and took my shotgun and took $40. Um, so yeah, just oh. keep an eye on Flatneck when you can. Um, okay. and then, uh, yeah, we want to find out who in Strawberry is handing out handcuffs, and then, uh, who else is, and then it's, um, and yeah, anytime you're heading over to, like, St. Danielson to help out, if you get some free time, uh, inquire, question a Miss Harriet, a horse lady, um, she may oh, be connected yeah. to these posters going up about one free crime, which is oh. not true at all. No, it isn't that oh, not true. Oh, really? So this, I can't use this? No! You've got one? Oh. 
No, that's oh, not true that. at all. Uh, no, no, uh, I would not have one of those. Can I arrest her now? No. Oh, we're good. But yeah, just if anyone could go and question Harriet and get her to, like, if she's involved or find out what she knows, get her to stop if she's involved and just write a report on it for our paperwork, that would be great. Because, yeah, the two times I've talked and spoken to her in St. Denise, she's always yelling about one free crime. So if anyone's connected to these pulses, she'd be my first guess. Met some of our new recruits last night. I think we've got, like, four coming west, apparently. Well, well, that's the thing. Yeah, if we that's if nice. we if we see the scales, it's way too high on the west side. I think it's fair that we yeah have a chat and see about evening yeah. out with the wet east. Because yeah, like I said, Wolf and I sat down. We've uh, made it that the uh, the pay is the same on both sides. That's a good idea, uh, actually. So no one gets jealous. That's right. And uh, we're going to see how the next month why goes. It well, what what were yeah, we? It wasn't before. It was we, very skewed before. We want to see how the next month goes with e with each ledger. To see if, you know, one department gets ahead of the other just because they've got more successful dealings with crime. And uh, we're going to reassess it in a month's time, maybe increase it for both. And yeah, Wolf has implemented a, yeah, a tar system with the ranks. And yeah, we want to have constant meetings just to keep everything on the same page between the departments. We, we want to squash any rivalry or stupid competition. We want everyone to work together. I want to beat yeah, the other side. That's why it should be anyway. I mean, we're all one county. It's just that it's mm. split, so it's easier to handle. So and remember, manage. I don't understand why there was competition. Yeah, same. There shouldn't be competition. No, it should have been, especially for money for the departments. Yeah, that's yeah. it. Just, just be split right. evenly between all departments. Well, that's the other agreement Wolf and I have had is that if any uh, department gets like a bonus from the governor. We split Where's it. Where's that coming from? There was that again. There's that noise again. We, we, we split it between the departments and we even give some to the rangers. Did you hear that whistle? Yeah. I heard a whistle. I thought coming only from. officers had... Yeah, we don't always can have it. Yeah. Unless there's one around here. Now, question. Because I, I, I feel like it's always changing. How do I check alerts? Oh, you do, a, I think, alert. Oh, shit. I think slash alert menu. Okay, so if there was an alert, something would come up. Yes, then you do, then you say, yes, I'll be going to it. Okay, all right. Just, I feel like once we learn something, then it changes. I know I do prison processing, so that's one good thing. Yeah, I had a bit of a refresher on that. Um, my God, it's a lot. But, but how are you doing, Louisa? Oh, look. I stepped in, uh, I woke up today, and then I stepped in to go on duty, and there was already someone lying on the ground waiting to be seen to. So I helped them, and I just finished them, and I had another Guan call, and uh, William was telling me that he had, like, nine already today. I, I felt what? like it's going to be one of those days. Nine already? And, oh. Yeah. Wo and, uh, Woodman processed the IDs of three of uh, John Black's boys, including John Black himself in Valentine oh, earlier. Okay. Yeah, that humbled him. <laughs> yeah, and the Hickey boys had our back. It was great. I just got a um, question for you. I, ran you? All, I rode all the way to the mountain for someone who fell off a cliff, and oh, I couldn't see him. I met a bear. Bear chased after me. <laughs> uh, I managed to cl clamber on a rock and scared him off with an arrow or two. It's like had an um, exciting day. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so... Did anyway. you say you had a question, Jack? Are we allowed to make people get IDs? Well... Yeah, like a, I'm not too sure about that one. Well, on, yeah. Walk them down there, or, or you book them for not having an ID. Yeah, just book them, I think. We have... Well, okay, okay. there it is again. What the fuck? We have been given a lot of warnings. Way? Yeah. Yeah. So I think, too. Try what that's coming but from. Yeah, it does get to the point where, yeah, you walk it's them down or... the or, bridge, isn't it? Well, if they don't want to walk down and get one with us right then and there for $5, well, they're going to be looking at a fine for more than $5 and still yeah. no ID. Like the whole drug dealer, what the fuck? And I tried to tell people it's just so that when bank robberies and stuff happen, we that? quickly identify anyone. Yes. What a Kaliga. Who's that? Me too. I say it was Kaliga. Yeah. yeah. We're not. Yeah, Louisa, you heard that whistle, heard right? I got crazy. Yeah. Yeah, it's not. It's not really me, but it wasn't me this time. Yeah, careful not to abuse that, because yeah, now no. times like this, it could be someone pranking us. 
but no one else could have it except for us. I really hope That's it's not. That's what they like drugs. Those naughty, cheeky little monkeys. Really hope it's not coal like. Well, up on the hill over there. With a sprained no, ankle. I know what they're selling. You know, last thing I know what they're selling. What, Kaliga? Yep, in the in the saloon. Oh, oh no way. Where'd that whistle come from? I just I can never tell which direction. I mean, it could be on the other side of the county. That whistle would hear it still. Oh really? Very loud. Oh god! Oh, it's away. not that loud. It's around here somewhere, surely. Oh no, well you can hear it from miles away. Nah. God damn it! You can hear it from outside of Valentine. What? Voice. Wait, who's that? That's not Clink, is it? I don't know. That's what I thought. Yeah, some so of the new fellas like Zane Ryder seems like he's got his head on right. Uh, Dax Indiana seems like he's got his head on right. Who's um, the group on the hill? Some Sorry, did you see all them? Yeah, yeah. That's horrible. Okay. Oh, it is. Huh. Woman. Did you get a good view of that person I was talking to? Which one? The man with the blonde hair. No. I swear crap, it was him. blonde hair now. It's always had blonde hair. Uh, no, it's had dark brown hair. Dark brownish. Well, it turns out it's in your eyes at the time. Yeah. Look. Oh, oh again! What the fuck? <laughs> well, they're taking photos of us. That whistle's driving me mad. Where the hells are coming from? I really help. Imagine if it's someone like, that's like, actually they've fallen we, over. We, uh, to know that it's only law that get it right. Yes, only, only law can do it. Yeah. How do you do it? Uh, hold your left alt muscle. Uh, and then at, what? Yeah, alt eye. That's it. Oh. Oh, I wonder if they'll whistle back. How loud is that thing? In this proximity. Oh, they're taking photos of us before. Who were? The person ran up the hill was taking a photo of us. Why? There's a whole group up there. Yeah, they're taking photos. Hmm. Okay. They want to... Oh no! They know who the lawmen are. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yes! Yeah, congratulations, you've taken a photo of the law department. They were in a town on the west side. What a shocker. Some of these people, they, I don't know what the hell they think. And Actually, when we had John Black earlier, we should have just took him over to the east side because they still want him over there. Food for thought next time. Yeah. Yeah. He's up there just anyway. drop him at their doorstep. Oh, whoopsie daisy. He's up there anyway. There you go, Wolf and yeah. Joy. Got a wave to him? Oh, we're doing a wave to him. Was that, was that you? That was me. Oh. If you're getting a whistle back. Probably them. How would they have a whistle, though? I don't know. Crafty sons of bitches. Probably, probably a blacksmith out there somewhere that sells them on the black market or something. That'd be rude. Well, apparently there's someone out there, a blacksmith out there somewhere... Making handcuffs and handing them out to people. And people yeah. reckons it was the strawberry blacksmith. I hope they don't fall off the rocks. Oh. <sighs> Alright. Well, I guess we head down to. I want to go out to Little Creek. I want to look around there for uh, if there are any campsites. Hey, I don't what? Want is. Huh? I don't know what one campsite is. We may as well Wait. while we're here. 
It's near Aurora Bison. Oh, okay. No, no. Uh, out by a little creek, you know, uh, Strawberry Fields. Oh yeah, but oh, Aurora actually, Bison. Over. Yeah, actually, none of you guys have a lockpick on you, do you? No. Nope. Okay. Why is that? Uh, because if you have a lockpick, no. you can. Uh, you Be can. Careful. Uh, huh? The rocks there. Oh, you can. Uh, what, what's the word? Raid the camp. Oh jeez. My horse woman. That, that way you can find out whose camp it is. Well, I'm happy if we take a ride around, take a look for some potential campsites now. There's nothing else going on, as far as we know. Let's get your horseshoes fixed. Louisa, if you're... Uh, if, oh, I'll send him on his way. Louisa, if you're not Ow. needed, you're Thank welcome you to join off. us. Oh, okay. I guess just in case Just in case. Need well, yeah, we could run. No, in my luck, I'll get fucking mauled by a bear. Oh, yeah. Well, I can never be on hand if need. You coming, Louisa? Here we go. Oh. Holy shit. I told Mr. Tillager I was still in Strawberry. Where are you headed? Uh, I think we're heading north. I'm just gonna flee it. I was wondering what that light was. Hang on. Oh, you come come on here? Oh. oh, fuck. Let's go. Louisa! Oh, where's our doctor? Hey, Louisa, hurry! Coming. Shoot shit, at him, Blackwater! Oh, oh, shit, 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 shit. Let's go. Shit. Go, go, go. Oh, God. Well, Lapis will find his way home. <laughs> Oh, I've taken, I've taken the wrong turn. God damn it. Hold on, Miss Louisa. All right. Hey, Mitty. How dare you. Also, yeah, Tom Royal, that's good to hear. Because, yeah, we just, we want, we want to be mindful of, um... Because for ages, you know, the sure East had more than the West, and we definitely don't want it to then flip the other way, where the West has got everyone, and the East has only got, like, three people. We, we really want to be mindful of that. Prodzy, unban ya? From what? The ch wait. From what? The chat? Yeah, and it's, it's not very often we see people in Strawberry to begin with. Yeah. Seem deliberate. Oh god, I'm a little bit nervous as to what we're going to find down here in Blackwater. Okay. If it helps, I haven't got a report yet. Fingers crossed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Guys, the horse gone. Let's give us a pain. One ding eagles, three woodmen, so the balance will be fine. Third off at it, apparently. Do we know where in the bank oh, or? I see, I did, there's people down there now. Oh, fuck. Uh, it's near the Blackwater Slough. Oh, of course oh, it is. On, I'm gonna go on the roof. I'm gonna jump off now. I'm gonna hop off here. Oh, it's better. Let's follow Jack.
Body is sheriff. I don't know what's going on. I what the hell town. happened? Oh my god. What's going on? There's a lot of sheriff bodies. Moment. We just pulled up. What the hell? What the fuck's going on? Uh, what's going we on? We just heard a fuck ton of shooting. Lots of people in black. There was some up on that roof. Of Hello? <laughs> oh, See here, this is. fucked up, eh? <laughs> Pony, can you hear me? Oh my god, it's a trail of corpses from the bank! I'm just gonna take his off his mask. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, well, well, well! He's your friend, <laughs> Georgie. All right. My friends? Who is it? You'll see. Cut our masks Oi. off. Wait, John. Get in here. The bodies just get keep get yeah, yeah, yeah. piling up! you probably find more on the roof. Doctor. Sorry, doctor. Give me a more doctors for you. Jesus, what the hell? Oh my god, oh, damn nice. penis is being. Is that you, Zoe? Are you putting them, Mr. Hut? How are you yes. feeling? You're right. Oh, I'm not entirely sure. Here. Just yeah, Sheriff. maybe put them all here for the doctors. Hey. Give me a little. Let me get more doctors yeah, in here. That. Sorry if I sound like yeah, a little boy. Well, I'm sick. <laughs> um. Who would you like? Thank you so much. I'm sick. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Shut up, really. Oh, hey, uh, Miss oh, Louisa. That's a lot. Where, where is she? What oh, she's just over here. Explain what just happened. Uh, we've got another one on the roof as well, Miss Louisa. I can't get him off the roof, though. Okay. Uh, shit. Holy shit. Who, who yeah, shot well. him? I'll tell you that. I'll tell you what did happen, though. Who s did you see what happened? Yeah, I did. I can tell you what happened. Jesus what happened? Well, let, let, come over here. We'll just so we'll, uh, the doctor has some breathing room. What the, what the heck happened? I got a pretty good feeling, George, that what just went down in Valentine somehow just leaked down into Blackwater. Like seven, yeah, I put a load out. Woman sucked your eye on him. Started trying to kill innocent folk, you know? Wait, these fellas? These fellas are right here, yeah. Yeah, um... Hurt innocent folk in town. Blackwater. Trying to kill people, yeah, left, right, and center. I seen one on our way in. They must have got away, but they seemed pretty wounded. But these gentlemen were just blowing away anyone here. And, oh, you yeah. Know, there's a bit of the smoking gun, but there's a few uniforms there that look like just cut your coat off. But then who, who dropped them? That's what we don't know. We just got don't here. Know. Don't know. It we were me, yeah, because we, we saw you up at Strawberry, didn't we? Yeah, you did. Yeah, we Is that who you ago. were? I yeah, was... yeah, we were on. We were whistling a little bit. <laughs> I was taking photos of you. Thought you. Why are we taking cute. photos of us? I oh, know. I just think it's funny to take, take photos, photos of people. Of take photos. Of <laughs> oh, God. well, to each their own, I guess. But, uh, they, they, you look really nice. Over here. Oh, it's kind of you. Yeah. We, we try to you hear try to have showers, at baths every chance we get because <laughs> we fucking need it. One, <laughs> take one step in Valentine is time for a bath. I know that's what I'm gonna say. Valentine is. I have to have at least three baths. Oh, that! Sure. Look at this one over here. He's left all by himself, away from his pals. That big, the one who talk. Just keep putting badges on a woman. Yeah. Okay. George, I might grab the east to come over. Sounds like pops off. That's yeah. Considering this, this hey, one, two, three, four, I'm five, six. Criminals. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm, I'm an innocent bystander. He's, he's, he's a bystander. He got in the crossfire. Oh right. Okay. I so we're splitting them up. Shot. I see. Sorry. Sorry, so I didn't realize. All I thought right. I thought they might have been all your friends. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. sorry. Jesus, pull me down nicely. Can I pull you nicely? Hey, don't kick him! Uh, it's my lady. brother, it's brotherly love. Oh. Hey, uh, I tried to get the fell off the roof before, but uh Oh fuck. I flipped. Oh my god. He's my brother, it's alright, oh, it's alright. Yeah, there's two on the roof, I can't pick them up. It was like a, a standoff. It's crazy. Between who? I don't know. These guys and who? Uh, between a shotgun and my penis. Oh, get your mind out of the gutter. I got, I've been shot in the goddamn penis. Have well, some sympathy. The doctors will deal with it. There's there's a long oh, line of... the lead. It stings. I bet. It. Just go to your happy place. It burns. Do you have any nice memories? Uh... Yeah, your happy place. You know, like, what, what was your favorite food to eat as a kid? Sausages. Well, just think about sausages. Wait, no, don't oh, think about sausages. Damn it. No, that's just, no, that's gonna, 
make it remind you of your ailment. No, don't. Okay. Uh, what was your second favorite thing to eat as a child? Cucumber. Anything non phallic. I like fruit. What? Cows. I swear to God, if you say banana, if you say banana, what kind of fruit? Don't you fucking say it. Curry cotton bites, not a fruit. Watermelon. Yeah, that's better. That's different shape. Good. All right, just just think about think about those days we were yeah. carefree as a child, eating nothing but watermelon, oh. nice summer breeze, just, God, and just hanging there. The doctor will be with you shortly. There's just there's a bit of a there's a bit of a, a cue at the moment. And, but more uh, more doctors should be on the way, okay? I'm a, it's starting to feel numb. I, I bet. I bet. I can't feel my penis. Yeah, I'm, a, I'm aware. It, it, it will be fine. Modern medicine is really quite something. Uh, <laughs> For fuck's sake. Jesus Christ. I'm ready to get this oh, one up. Hey. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Darnell, how are you feeling? Oh, not so good. Right. Better, but Can you sit, uh, step this way for a second? And just have a chat to maybe one of the sheriffs. Darnell, come with me, please. We'll go down, give the doctor some space. Okay. Now, Darnell. Yeah. You know, you probably know what I'm about to say, don't you? No. Well, you remember what I was talking to you and John about in Valentine? Yeah. About keeping trouble out of towns. We well, didn't start nothing, mister. What, what, what happened? Walk us through it. I was just talking to a man, and then he pulled a shotgun out and shot Jed. And he He's shot always the victim. He shot all five of you? Well, I don't know. There was a few people involved. Did you see him? Well, there was a man back over there on the back of that street, end of that street. There was someone in the saloon. There was someone standing on the side, and there was this fellow we was talking to. I don't know who he was. Oh, did he? Uh, so he didn't give you a name? I don't know. I'm pretty sure John knows him. I don't quite know him myself. What did he look like? Uh, he had black hair. Uh, he had black suit on, kind of. I don't know. Okay, so John John might know more. John might. But you boys didn't come into town looking for trouble, did you? No, we wasn't starting nothing. You, you were just confronted, and then you attempted to defend yourselves, is that right? Barely. Man okay. pulled out a shotgun and shot Jed. Now, is this all your boys? Is everyone accounted for on the ground over there? Got talking. Uh, you pretty sure John Dusty went up on the roof. Yeah, I think he's up in the roof. There's someone up in the roof I can't get down. You want me to try? All right, you can give it a, a try. Yeah, yeah, if you're feeling better. Yeah, we got to get him down here for the doctor. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Yo, Rando. There's also, I think, two on a rooftop somewhere. The biggest, yeah. the biggest can show you where the seagull yeah. attack. Yeah. yeah, I think William's going to go up on the roof to look after the two on the roof. Uh, I'll show you, William. Yeah, thank you. Oh. Howdy, Wolf. Hey, but, hey, Sheriff. I, I didn't know if uh, y'all y'all were around. I got, got two calls and. Oh uh, yeah, Hawk just put out word because because yeah. we're just because yeah, yeah, we ride into accident. town, fucking six people being shot by a group of people like an ambush. It seems there was people hiding in the saloon, hiding in alleyways, back streets, and they just can they confronted the Hickey boys here and then blew them to hell. It's been a real. Quite a peaceful evening, and then we come in and we find they're they're literally between the bank up to here at the doctor's office, Sheriff's just a line of fucking bodies. Get up. Oh, Miss Louise, is the best. Get another one up. Okay, all right. Okay. I'll, uh, you you just let me know what uh, you want yeah, me and my we, deputy we, to do. Uh, oh, just, we're just questioning them all. Triage and move them move them away. We've done triage. Um, yep, uh, fantastic. Got, we got two doctors yeah. here. Yep. Yeah, uh, we're just questioning them all now. Yep. All right. Uh, Next one. All right, let's get them out. Oh. 
Here's some painkillers. All right, next one. All right, let's, let's go stop. have a chat. All right. All right, I'll lead the way. All right, Todd, you yeah, you you handle this one. All right, uh, uh, just down the road, sorry, here, fella. Yeah, yeah, just down the road okay, a little bit. Thank Zoe you. Zoe and Terrence standing up there. This is the biggest seagull attack to date. <laughs> the Great Blackwater Seagull Massacre. <laughs> Jed. Jed. In my face. I'm so confused as to what happened. Oh, this gentleman, he is bleeding slow down a lot, so. I'm actually kind of tempted to go. I, I think because I think Fatal or Fatigue plays as a couple of the main Hickey boys. Like I'm tempted. I hope they clipped what happened because I'm actually quite curious to see. Like what? The, like there's so many bodies, dude. It's a massacre. It's one more guy, but yo, honey, but are you watching? I okay please. Yeah, please tell me, like, I'm going to have to go... Yeah, someone's going to have to link me, because I'm like... I am so curious to see what the hell happened. Like, the body's just lined up from there down to here. The absolute madness. Oh, no. I think he slid down the ladder, so now he's got that... ...sound bug. Second kiss? You, yeah, yeah. Okay, so I was just chatting to one of them then. I'm trying to piece together because for a minute now I thought it might have been John Blackscrew that was involved, but actually wasn't. Based right. On timing. Because yeah. We saw, we saw them in Strawberry, right? That's right. They and, left. And we rode about two minutes out of Strawberry and then we got the call and we came running down here, right? And then John Black and that were already here. Yeah. So I was asking that fella how long were they talking to, to the people up. that opened fire on them? They said about five to ten minutes at least. Okay, so sure. it rules out uh, John Black's group. Yeah. That, that were at Strawberry all together. They reckon uh, John Hickey might have a... Up. Oh, next one. Oh, what about me? What about me? Well, let's give you some pain. It is not care. <laughs> Thank you, Doc. Okay, you were yeah. How are you feeling, Jet? I'm a bit right. You did a good job. So good. Was that Jed? Was it? Yeah, this one's Jed. All right. Do you, do you mind just answering a few questions from a uh, Todd Woodman here? Is that, this one here? Oh, just me. Yeah, just come down here. Yes. Thanks. Anything I can be doing to help? Where's John Dusty? Who's that? Who's that near the, the pot over there? Oh, that was a bystander. He's been shot in the penis, oh. ma'am. You okay? Ow. I'm sure. Oh, there's the other Oh, mama. Oh. She's been shot in the penis, ma'am. Mr. Hughes. Howdy, Jeb. Mr. Hughes. What a mess. Yep, my horse. That's what I mean. Good luck. Oh, thank you. Hello, 
Can you hear me? That's right. My name's Billy. Oh, in my shoulder, my left shoulder. Dear, oh dear. Dear, oh dear. Alright, we've got more info. Let's have a chat. <laughs> piece by piece. He said, so he was the one that got shot, but he said he was talking to a fella in the middle of the street. Now, he doesn't know the fella's name, but he said he was with a doctor. A female doctor. Oh, f oh fuck. So oh, no. We, we, we had one female doctor with us, which was obviously Miss Louisa, so it wasn't her. And I haven't obviously seen Cynthia Wheeler on that. So it could have been Cynthia then, since we well, haven't seen her? I, I doubt it. She's got a pure heart. I doubt it could be her, okay. but right. that um, there's a couple more. There's a Raven, and Raven, there's a yeah. and, and there's Dolores. yeah, yeah. Speaking of, and Ow. she's got a white gun because he said she had a white gun. You, Dolores, this guy, he's pretty Ms. talkative. Dolores. Oh, oh, he shot the penis. I beg your pardon. This guy said he's been shot and he's very talkative. Uh, oh, uh, it might not have been the weenie. I think it's just my inner. We've got, we've got a question. She, she mentioned the description. She's got the white gun as well. Shit, maybe, maybe, maybe we wait till we talk to all these boys and maybe we talk to her privately later, away from everybody. Give her that professional uh, courtesy. Do, uh, this man just appeared. Where? Oh. Mask off and tear. Oh! Ah! Get down! Oh, fuck! Thank you. Have we got a word on... Where the John Hickey is? Uh, is he down here or is he up the stairs? I think he was on one of the rooftops. Okay, I'll ask I think William. that's John right there. Where? In, where, uh, where William's treating. Oh. All right. Yeah. All right. Just gonna right. give you some stitches now, All but right. I will put some cocaine paste down for you. Yeah. I'm gonna pop this one up. It should be fine to, uh, to to have his jacket back on and stand up. And help you stand. There you go. Okay. Thanks, man. Uh, Appreciate it. Relief going in, and then we'll stitch you're not it out of the woods yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, so hey, long man. How are you doing? Howdy. Howdy again, John. Yeah, if you could follow a Woodman and Harkness here uh, and no, just answer a few questions, that'd be that'd be good. Okay. okay. <laughs> Hills, we've got this one ready now. All right. Oh, thank you. Oh, oh Jesus. Uh, easy, fella. Easy. Right. Yeah, easy. How are you feeling? Uh, pretty good. Yeah, I'm a bit woozy. So I'm all right. You're another hickey Where boy? Oh, uh, yeah. Yes. Oh, all right. Yeah, come on down. Come down. Come join John and the other two right. The other yeah. two lawmen. Oh, where are you going? Down That's now. a big needle. Oh, you big baby. It's fine. No, the other way. Oh, other way. Oh, shit. Oh, down this way. Oh, okay. God damn! Yeah, they were just lined up in the street. And we got the the last hickey boy here. Right. Okay. So who who pulled the shotgun on you? Saloon man did. Okay. Right. Uh. Yeah, okay. Uh... Yeah. Is it alright if I go on my head for a second? I just gotta go put some devils to bed. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I'll just go down here. Okay, uh, one more question. Did he have, uh, Mr. Loris with him as well? 
Um, the, the the lady dropped off the white gun. Yeah, yeah, she was there. I thought she was Dottie, and I said, "Oh, is that Dottie there?" And he right, said, okay. "Um, no, that's Mr. Dolores, the the medic." And I said, "Oh, hi, Mr. Dolores, your your fam, we're looking around for you, looking for Dottie." And um, that's kind of right after that, which kind of went went. Why were you shot? Well, he came up to me. I just said that he she she came up to me. He just said, "Oh, you you shot my friend the other day." There was a shootout Gentlemen, where we uh, had to defend ourselves. Just real, just real I don't know if you remember and, that. Uh, yeah, make sure. I think so. He died up. Uh, he's not his handcuffed. And apparently, the person that the you know, yeah, he was um, identified as we took out in self defense was well, the, was the saloon owner's he friend. Because he was with the us. Saloon owner Dan took it into his own hands. He wasn't. We just scooped him up off the fucking roof. Jesus Christ! He just confessed to everything, Carter. Yeah, I was on. I was on the roof. Like defend, like making sure you boys were okay. Yeah, it was so. self defense. The fucking saloon owner shot first. None of us even pulled the trigger. Yeah, yeah, no, we're, we're just square in the chest. Chest. We're, we're, yeah, yeah, no, just, yeah, yeah. Just yeah. so there's not mixed stories. No, no, absolutely. Oh, this, yeah, no, oh, we're just crossing T's, dotting the eyes. Yep, that's yeah, it. That's so me. We just wanted to bring him down here for the lineup and just make sure he's all yep. clear with y'all, gentlemen. Okay. Thank you. Are you, are you gonna yeah, use Hey, is that the Shannon? What, what, what? Oh, uh, we just, you need anything else from this guy, Mr. Hughes, or? Oh, yeah, no, Todd, camera? if you've asked everything you, yeah, you want. Yeah, oh, I hear just yep, like having yep. talking. Yeah. Right. Uh, we were just, yeah, just, well, shit, I got yeah. shot. Just about it. Wolf, you got a sec? Yes, absolutely. Right. I fell down here. I don't like acting in self-defense, uh, but I will if I have to. This sounds like an absolute fucking shit show. This sounds like, what we're gathering is that, uh, sounds like, like, I don't know, the Hickey boys might be pulling a, a, a Yanking our chain. It sounds like they'll come through town. They were confronted yep. by the saloon owner, mm -hmm. and he, uh, he was with Miss Dolores. And they had uh, they had people in the in buildings, rooftops, alleyways. And they blew them all to hell. That's the story we're getting. But I don't know. Maybe the Hickey Boys came to end aggravating people. Hmm. I wonder if this has uh, something to do with what I with our, what I witnessed uh, a few nights back. Uh, with uh, multiple uh, riders on on black black horses with the blacked out outfits, and they shot the shooter loon up to shit, part I tell you. Sounds like I did overhear some. It sounds like if the saloon owner and Dolores and his crew did attack these boys, it was in retaliation for the Hickey boys shooting one of the saloon owner's friends in the last few days. But all all we know. Like five, six hickey boys dead in line, dead in the street in Blackwater. That is the only facts we have. And they've uh, they're pointing out Mr. Marcus Dunn. Well, yeah. The, the the more we got to you know the key plays of the hickey gang, it is pointing to uh, Marcus Dunn, definitely of the saloon, accompanied by Mr. Loris, and then. You know, God knows how many people lying in the shadows nearby. Well, it's a, what's the doctor embedding herself in with um, with a posse and then shooting folk? Yeah, well, sound, yeah, it sounds like she was directly involved. And, you know, based on everything else we've been talking to with her getting cozy with Mr. Dunn, it adds up. What you think? We, we try and extract her right now. We take her out of town. We, we fucking, we give her old school question. Oh, you okay? Yeah, yeah. Well, and, that, uh, that's the thing. We, Todd, we Todd brought up the idea. What would you recommend? Because this is very fucking delicate. If 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 it's your professional opinion, that maybe you and maybe you and uh, the other East boys pick her up and take her somewhere secluded and question her. That's fine by me. Hi. What are okay? You so spoke to five of them all separately, so they couldn't come. You know, collude stories. Mm -hmm. All the stories exactly the same. All so, pointing to uh, so they came into town. Mm -hmm. uh, they wanted to talk to uh, to talk to Miss Dotty about something. Right? Miss Dotty. So, Miss Dotty. That's right. Um, and okay. they asked the, uh, the saloon over over there, Mr. Marcus Dunn, and Miss Dolores was with him. Right. Anyway, uh, they were talking for several minutes, and then uh, Mr. Dunn then uh, pulled out his shotgun and shot one of the hickeys, and then all hell broke loose from there. So, well, Marcus uh, said he uh, came into town. Huh? That's after all happened. Who did? Marcus, that's what he said. A Dolores rode into town when we, when I was. Yeah, no, people. they're both here. 
they were both here. All Hickey, every single Hickey boy said the exact same thing. And did you see? Did you see her leave a building or anything? Or since she was already on site here, ready to go? No, she rode into town. I saw yeah, her ride into but town. She, they, they all said a, a, a lady doctor with a white gun, and then she comes rolling in. Yeah, Marcus Dunn and Dolores came in late, uh, both from yeah. um, the governor's building side of town. Yeah, well, Marcus Dunn was the one that shot the Hickey. Every single Hickey has said it was him. Like, as I said, I spoke to five of them separately, and they all gave the exact same story. But it's still more okay. people to corroborate the it's just in the shootout. That's five witnesses, though. Yeah, but they got a grudge with them. Oh, Figured yeah, I know, but... Court. Yeah, but I still spoke to them all separately. You feel like one of them would have slipped up if there was something um, different going yeah. on? Allegedly, um, what some of them said, my, uh, they said the saloon owner started the shooting. Uh, mm. I asked him, and he said he he was he showed up late. Um, which is probably bullshit, but yeah, yeah. Well, we've had five of them say that he was the one that they were talking to in the middle yeah. of the street. See, this mm. is very delicate because this could quickly become, you know. God, God forbid it goes to court or something, because the only, what, how I'm looking at it is the only facts we know, bunch of hickey boys lying in the street. That's the only facts we got. Well, and five men were questioned separately and all gave the exact same uh, alibi story. Yeah, cover story. Mm, but, 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 yeah. Then, but, then, but then how would they, you know, why would they all have a cover story that it's fucking, did any of them... Mention the doctor. Like, why, why would they all have a... Yeah, yeah, several of them did. So it's like, why, why would the cover story be that, gentlemen? E exactly. You know, that, it, that, don't, that don't make sense. Because they know that they would get their fucking asses kicked if they were to fuck with doctors, right? I'm pretty sure, yeah. you know, folk folk are quite aware. You know, yeah. you, you fuck with doctors and it's... Yeah. You, so, you know, that there already is ringing, ringing bells, you know? That's a very good point. And I wonder where that is. Well, I, Wolf, yeah, look, was we, it? I, I, if you got an idea, like if you and Cole here wanted to go grab Mr. Loris and have just a chat, like however you want to play uh, that, it. That, that yeah, I don't know, it won't be a chat, but it'd be heading down to New Austin. You know, that, that's what it's going to be. You know, Big if it's call. An extraction, you know, it's, it's, it's a straight, it's straight, it'd be straight down there. Would we grab uh, Mr. Dunn as well? Do we keep him? Yeah. Do we grab both of them? Keep them in separate rooms? Are his men around here? Yeah, no. Those there's, fellas there's, in the there's, saloon. Yeah, there's way, way too many eyes anyway. Yeah, those fellas in the saloon, they all have their guns uh, ready, and they're, they're like, when I when I approached uh, Mr. Dunn, he immediately started uh, heading toward the saloon staircase, and he's had like his, uh, I don't know, the saloon <laughs> workers are armed and stuff, uh, like ready, if he's gonna be arrested or something like that. So. Shit. All right, well, uh, fuck it. Um, I, I say, I say, we walk up in there, sheriff, and uh, okay. we we see what the fuck you got to say. Um, yeah. Yeah. Hello there. All right. Yeah. Out. Fucking that. yeah, shoot folk sure. up in town. Yeah. Hello. All right. You um, good? Yeah. No, I just want to say thanks for um, you know, putting pressure on some of those patients, and right. also, yeah. Um, right. just nope, got another yeah. call out to Valentine. So. Okay. Uh, Thank you. For fuck. Your yeah, thank you. Um, yeah, it was good that I was running along. And Fuck. Can you put guns away in damn place? Yeah, yeah, I don't appreciate being you threatened. Um, Marcus, you work at the saloon, Marcus yeah? Dunn. Do I work at the saloon? Marcus. Western East Law Departments, anybody home? Just me, sheriffs. Ingo. Uh, Mr. Wolf, pleasure. Howdy. George Hughes, I hear you've gotten a promotion. Congratulations. Thank you. Busy, uh, being busy outside. <laughs> it's quite, quite the, uh, quite the situation. Another day in Blackwater. Unfortunately. Ah, uh, yes, Headless Bob of the Saloon. Uh, and, uh, you, 
How are you doing? Come with me, sir. Hey! Oh! oh. 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 Hey! Oh. Wrong muscle. Wrong muscle. Not Wrong like muscle. that, sir. Jeez. I'm sorry, sir. How dare you? Where's Marcus? I have no idea. No idea. Um. Broken my back. Uh, has times. anybody seen Lieutenant? I've been after my Lieutenant all day. Oh, your brother looks like Mozzie Owl. I'm sorry, no, I haven't seen it. That's how the first time I was. Oh, I've talked to you guys countless times about it. I was thrown down. A bit noisy, sorry. Does anybody have Lieutenant's telegram number? Uh, you might I, do. I do. I um, do. Would you mind sharing it with me, please? Yeah, I do. Yeah, come uh, come, follow, follow me. Miss yeah, we'll sure. get out of town. It is right. It's too loud. Holy shit, it's loud. Thank you. Um, have you seen this? Yeah, poor guy. Yep. Jesus. See the we see the um, little brothers in town again. If they've got their guns on the back, they're getting fired. Little brothers, right? I told so, them a couple of times. No, I, I think I've told them the same. Sounds good to me, Jack. Put your gun away. Did you see Mr. Ames before? Yeah, he's on one of the yeah, rooftops. Oh, what's he doing? She enjoyed work as a marshal. That is, that is absolutely ridiculous. He's a uh, he's mark. <laughs> Alright, Mr. Lawrence. Let's cut the bullshit. Where's Marcus Dunn? And what you doing with him? What do you mean what you doing with him? We we fucking we, we know. Okay, we, we got we got we got your name written all over that saloon. I fucking tell you what. Well, you'd have to be pretty blind not to realize that Marcus Dunn and I are in a relationship. It's not like we've hidden it. So, what? So you're saying that uh, you're coming in him? What, you shooting folk? I don't shoot anyone. Just with morphine? I'm a doctor. I don't shoot anyone. If anyone's accused me of shooting them, then they're completely wrong. I don't shoot anyone. Okay. Are you aware uh, Mr. Dunn has, has been seen multiple times in, uh, you know, multiple different outfits. You know, he, he got folk knocking at his door. He got, you know, we... You've we... got a posse running seven deep coming into this town. What are you going to do about that? Randomly shooting out businesses. Probably because Mr. Dunn likes to stick his fingers and his uh -huh. hands into other towns and be disrespectful to folk. Uh-huh. Yeah, uh huh. You don't, you don't think we, we, we got it piled up? What, what you think oh, we're fucking you coming up to you that... with nothing? Uh, you what, know you what? think we come all the way to the fucking head doctor, <laughs> take her out of the middle of the street <laughs> for nothing? You, you think we got uh. nothing? It's fucking, it, it, ain't, it ain't hard, Dolores. I haven't done anything. Well, I fucking hope not. I hope not. Yeah, I really do. Because, you know, when we come down hard and we, we, we come in that saloon, you, uh, we hope you ain't on the fucking, we hope you're on the right side there. If I choose to sit in the saloon and write my med medical reports and chill out after a day, that is my prerogative to yeah, do that. Yeah, no, absolutely, I'm not absolutely. not any laws to do no, that. No, no, absolutely. But sure. I, hope, I hope on the day that we come in that you find another fucking you saloon. You always want to fucking tell me why the criminals that shot up your town are riding out. And now they're laying dead in the field because they tried to shoot me. You want to talk to me about that? So basically, you know, Those we'll, gentlemen, we'll, we'll, you we'll have another conversation later on. But we, we get out of town. They shot up uh, your you know, town, so killing to your people. Everything's and fine. I haven't bars. done anything to be under suspicion. I will tell you one so thing. that I, If you see Lieutenant, I want to speak to him. No problem. Mr. Hughes, did you have anything to say? No, Drew Barrett. 
Just the same thought frame of mind as you, Mr. Wolf. You know, you fellas amaze me. I've done nothing but look after everyone in this county. I've come to every single call out you've ever needed. I've been there for you guys. I've always looked after you guys. And to be put in this position just because I happen to be seeing someone is just fucking beyond me. That's you're, gratitude for you. You're fucking lucky we didn't we didn't just fucking talk to you in the middle of the town in the middle of town well, and, maybe and not you give a fuck so who was there. Can see how well, much we, you we, we're just... giving you we're giving you the fucking respect. So next time maybe we won't. Get the fuck out of the office. Maybe you should talk to the fucking governor and find. Oh my god! Oh my god! I arrived late. Um, we press questions pretty much everyone. Um. But yeah, boys all got to do something, or soon again we'll all be in fucking martial law. George, no, what uh, why are those yeah. boys that just rode out of town up behind bars? Where are they now? They just rode out of town trying to get me. They're laying in a field face down now. You boys should have thrown them in fucking in. jail. Time. Came down here shooting your town, your people. Y'all ought to do something. Or we're, we're all stuck we're in getting, martial law. Yeah, no, when we understand that part, and, and I tr trust me, that's the last thing that Mr. Hughes or, or any department want. Yeah, and uh, you, you, you can oh, bet we, we, we love fucking Blackwater. We love the people here. Yeah. And, and we do anything to help to help the people. Yeah. And at the moment, we are getting so many conflicting stories, my, my partner, that it, it is, you know, we, we just got to cross the T's yeah, and dot the I's, so, you know? So and, and, and I'm, yeah, no, and yeah. unfortunately, you know, you know, when, when we ain't shining the light in the right direction at the moment, you know, we, we, you know, we're the first person that folk, you know, will blame, you know, and, uh, you know, we, we will, we will, we will get, we will get around it, you know, and we'll solve yeah, it. it. We are working back to a state where we have enough numbers in the West and East so that we could have people boots on the ground to witness these things. It's just, we are so spread thin with numbers. We've been checking Valentine's strawberry. It's just so because no one was here to see anything, we do have to go step by step and we're just, we're trying to, we're trying to, yeah, like Mr. Wolf is saying, cross our T's, dot our eyes as quickly as we can. Yeah, I know, I can see a few um, different colored vests. Can I? You ain't got the numbers, but, you know, you made a deal with a man who ain't alive no more to stop this shit. Let's not go back on that, all right? Uh, Mr. Fuck Blair. Martial law. Yeah, well, what's up? I wouldn't go um, bringing that up, considering the, the stories I've heard about Mr. Wilds doubling back on that. And within a week, he was beating up doctors in the street of Blackwater. He was threatening more doctors. And we got reports of his men telling the east side that this is they, they ramped up activity over there because of uh, apparently i gave him permission to do that so i would not be bringing up oh. mr calder thank you mr black he's he's dead he's dead he's dead as can be you're gonna end up with martial law here again that governor's gonna come down here and break all your balls it's not an issue to me i don't give a shit but it's your town so do something about it gentlemen if you need a hand, you know where to find me. Um, can I ask a question? Um, yeah. The the Hickey brothers said that Marcus Dunn was the one who started shooting. Um, do you know anything about that? or? No, there's like eight, nine men with masks rode into town just started shooting windows, fucking all sorts of shit. All right, I see. Like, I mean, they were shooting at probably the people, you know, I don't know. Like around the saloon were. area? Everyone had masks on. They got shot back and they all ended up face down here in town. So they... Were they shooting at the saloon? Uh, no, nah, more towards the bank. Alright, too. Fellas. But, we're gonna be stuck with martial law again, George, if you don't sort it out. But if it's martial law in Valentine, I don't care. Just not Blackwater. No, no, absolutely. No, Valent. Yeah. No, 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 you're right. You and you're right. You know, and we and we, you know, for for a while there, Blackwater was was it was good, it was clean. You know, and folk were mm. working their way up to Valentine to start cleaning that up, uh, because you know that was on my list. Because you know the folk there was were starting to take matters in their own hands. You know, fucking Mr. Gold was starting to you know paint the town's folk gold, and uh, you know it was fucking shit. Yeah. You know, everyone was turned into Walter Gold, so it was like yeah. fuck. Yeah, that was our next stop. But and then shit, and then we had yeah. just jurisdictional craziness. Yeah, I'm not asked for anything. You know who I am. You know what I do. But Blackwater should be a safe place. People should be able to come here and not get fucking shot in the face. I agree, 100 percent, 100 percent. Yeah, that's that's well, that's definitely one thing that we we, we have in common because we're the same. Y'all know what we do. Y'all know where to find us. And you know, if if y'all got any information at all, you know, name, location, partner, and uh, you know, we'll we'll be there. So anyway, but, I might leave you boys but, to it because you're busy. You got a lot on. Yeah. Um, yeah. One last thing, those those fellas that were shooting at you, the, those were the Hickey brothers, were they? 
Yeah, they didn't have fucking any masks at this time. Uh, um, they they might. I think the doctors. Hypothetically, might... they're laying down in a field somewhere. I heard. Yeah, yeah I think, no, I'm sure they all fell off. I their think horse. I think yeah. doctors. Uh, I think they called for sheriffs, and then the doctors turned up. Um, I'm not hundred percent sure. Um, yeah. Oh, for fuck's yeah, sake! I'm so sorry, on. partner. I know you want to kiss. That's me, the fucking right. cornbread. It's I have that fucking. On it's the Rhodes cornbread. It's it's too light. I told them more flour. I'm sorry, <laughs> partner. Less corn. Anyway, Fuck. I'll leave you boys to it because you got a lot on your plate. That's right. Thank you. But maybe next time throw them in jail. I can make it up. It's not a good look. What, what happens when the governor hears about this, George? What's gonna we we there? we come down. We find them all lying face down on the on the on the stones out there. Like, we, we can't, if we go throwing them in jail just on what people are saying, it's not fair that if we do it to others either. We can't just... Yeah, I know. you got that special book that tells you how to do things, I know. Like, it's it's much easier when we see someone speeding through town or they're, you know, walking around with a fucking shotgun in the bakery. Yep. You know, that yep. we can react to. But this, you know, it's... They could have they could have come down and just got shot down by people. But by the same token, they could have come down and getting in people's faces and had it coming. It's just we don't know and if we go go one way, it's it's a whole mess. So like these yeah. are the laws we try to live by. It'd be really great if everybody joined, be a perfect, joined be a perfect society. World, but I just heard a gunshot, I don't know about you guys, but yep. did you hear that? Don't be surprised if it's the same people. <laughs> yo Pram, yo Shelby. Oh, just... Oh, fuck. I have to just lose it. Oh, they're just wearing all black. Honestly, you'll hear them. They talk so much shit. They got gold guns as well. Yep, it's them. It's the Hickey Brothers. Alright, ladies yep. and gentlemen. What's, what's going on? Oh, they killed it. Ooh, oh, yeah, it's right. them. They talk so Brandon much. They live in Bla there. Valentine. They live in Valentine. Good friends with Walt Gold. Uh, flee your horse for the time being. They're just rude. Because they talk so much shit. Like, honestly. Come on now, everybody. You're welcome to continue yes. this conversation. Oh, just just off the street, please. Yes. Sorry. Bad. I've been a bit ill. Oh, there he is. The man hey, himself. Ladies and gentlemen, let's break up the crowd. Come on now, horses. Move on. Let's go. Um, the Higgy Brothers shut up, uh, Havana and Phoenix's, um... Head. Yeah. Yeah, he it's always calls me that. Shitty to do. Here, Come on, everybody, take it out of the street. Yeah, You're sorry. welcome to continue this conversation, the saloon, or on the sidewalk. Come on, now. Let's go up into the plains and have a ch Yeah. Um, Vanna. Yeah, heading mate. towards Valentine. I'm also getting reports the strawberries. Yeah. Um, also, uh, yeah. You got one real quick second. Yeah. We like John sitting there going, "Oh yeah, you know, I know what happened here. I saw it all." He didn't because he was only probably thirty seconds ahead of us. That's right. No, this is this feels like. Yeah. This feels like people trying to pit us, pit groups against each other, catch us yeah. in the middle. It just, it's a. Yeah. It's just yeah, gonna be so sorry, much better uh, when we got the numbers to have people here actually yeah. to witness things. Yeah, well, we know the timings from Strawberry to here and what happened and everything like that. So, yeah, no, it's something real stuff going on. I think we follow this a lot. This is, is Wolf still over there? I think we might split the group. It's because I'm here. I go out of county for three weeks, come back, everyone's back. They just love me. Honestly, obsessed. <laughs> Where'd he go? I think he might be out on the on the road there. Hello. Uh, Mr. Hughes. Howdy. Um, it seems like uh, uh, it's, everyone's it's, moving to Valentine. Yeah, like. they are. They are. They're we in search. They're in search of uh, folk who hit uh, Phoenix's um, uh, cattle herd. Phoenix oh, and a co-worker. Oh, sake. Yeah. So they're they're fucked now. They're look. I think you know. I've, I've reached out to Miss uh, Miss Montana and asked her if uh, you know she can give us some names. You know, obviously, you know they were masked, but uh, you know it's one of those things. I think uh, I'm not too sure how we want to play this, gentlemen. You know, uh, uh, observe. 
Yeah, that's it's true. hard because we don't have anything do. definitive. No, no, we don't. It's just words and whispers and crowds of folk. Well, um, John Black was lying before because we were in Strawberry and he was in Strawberry, right? When we left Strawberry, we we're gone out of Strawberry. What thirty seconds, George? That's when we got the call. Yeah, of, of yeah, the shooting yeah. He didn't here. see shit. We, we headed straight here. And he must have just got here before us. He saw as much as us. Yeah, he saw as much as us, which was fuck all. So he's full of shit. Where's uh, where's Jack and Cole? <sighs> they didn't get swept up in a group of folk. I'm just thinking, uh, it sounds like, yeah, people heading to Valentine and uh, there might be some trouble in Strawberry. Maybe we split the groups. I don't know. One, I... one group go to Strawberry, pop in there, the other go to Valentine, and then we both reconvene on Valentine. Well, because and... you got yeah. you got Walt Gold's group in Valentine. They see all this come through, they'll open fire. On Jesus them. Christ! The only the only thing I can think of, gentlemen, is if we all if we all mount up, okay, and we all head to Valentine, and we all yeah. go in slowly, okay. We just take it pace by pace, tree by tree. You know, we get up near the fucking graveyards there. You know, Shit! Because yeah, the they're back. going after the Hickey boys up there as well. Yeah. I mean, yeah, exactly. It's, it's, no, it's good call. And be, Marcus, yeah. I'm so sorry for freezing up today. Where? When? When? I just, I just feel like I've just not been displaying a lot of leadership no today. Way. It's just no. I, no, I, no. I did Fuck not. No. So I, I consider you as still as a mentor. Like even though I'm sheriff, I consider you like a mentor to my position here because like I did not have time to get any of this train from Bowman, and it's just happening real fast. So I do apologize if it, if it feels like I'm slipping. No hell no, hell fucking hell no, party. You, you just dealt with you just dealt with you know multiple wounded all down here triage. You know you got your deputies. You know to, fuck no, partner. You know we we just had we just had me up here. You know, we were able to just you know just go on a little you know little detour from that and fucking have a chat to folk. You know. So, Thank you, no, Mark. I just yeah. I need more. I just I need time to be looking to you and the marshals for guidance because I I just I'm I'm. I'm in the deep end here. I'm in the I fucking was, deep end. I was drowning last night, right? Look, well, here, here you go. I hey, was drowning man. last night, right? And Mr. Ames here, thank God for the marshal. I tell you what, because if the marshal wasn't there, you know, there was folk. I had folk everywhere. I had, I had people's. Uh, it was, it was fucking. It was like a valent. It was Valentine in my cells in Saint. Oh fuck. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. That, so, yeah, well, and I thought I was tail. slipping. Yeah, I, I didn't know how to. I can't. I, I don't know how to send folks Cisco. There you go. <laughs> So it's yeah no it's because uh, of because of Rangers uh, we 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 can't send folk to Cisco so that's something that I'm learning now. It's tough, but no, I think I think based on everything, you know, there may be trouble in Strawberry, but the fact is, you make a good point. The gold Gold's crew's up there. The Hickey Boys could yeah. be up there. This yeah. big group, this fucking mob yeah, might be yeah, heading up there. Up they're they're there. all yeah. going Valentine. Yeah, yeah. No, I, no, I think we all. Yep. I'll get the deputies. Yeah, so so. What are your deputies going up to? Uh, are they uh, they already headed up. Yeah, he's just headed up. Right, fantastic. All right, let's head up there. Yeah, Excuse me, sir. Marcus, I'll ride with you. Uh, give me yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Did see you up there. Yeah, yeah. You wouldn't believe it, partner. This motherfucker uh, robbed a general store in St. Denis and decided to jump on my horse. And, well, he fucking landed with a few buckshots, right? Went around the corner. I lost him. I right? got Miss Nadine. I said, you motherfucker taking my horse. You know, I thought maybe, you know, he might have had a migraine since the buckshots. I put his backside plus all the buildings and craziness. And he was laying down in some boxes. I took a I took a big U-turn and came back. He was laying down. And he tried, you know what he said to me? He said, uh, help, someone shot me. I said, fucking A, they did. And I shot it again. <laughs> Where'd Jack go? Jack was right here. Where'd he go? Or is that him there coming down the street? Oh, there he is. And where's Cole? Uh, he's made. Uh, he's made his way up there. I oh, think. Fuck. He's. he's Fucking he's a. John partner, he really is. He's really good. Of course. All right. He's gonna keep himself close to that group. All right, gentlemen. Once we clear a town, then you can tell me what's going on. Absolutely. Not before then, for obvious reasons. All right, we're on you, Mr. Wolf. 
I uh, was just making sure I can't see my deputy before we head out. Y'all, y'all gentlemen, uh, start start heading uh, towards um, uh, the bakery, and then uh, yep. yeah, make sure that uh, yeah you stay up uh, on uh, Emerald side there near the tracks, you know, on the train station there, and uh, yeah, we'll meet up there. You know, Copy where the that. Train, where the train the train meets the station. Bakery to the train. Bakery to the train station. Got it. Yeah, look, I, I trust I trust Wolf's judgment, but he went he went real hard on her. But imagine he had good reason to do so. Wait, where's Todd? Oh, there's Todd. Oh, Might have to see that over eventually. Hey, hey, Hugh. Yep. We we should all sit up in the top of Walt's gun shop. Oh, when when Wolf gets there, we'll run and buy him. He said to uh, stop by the bakery. Head through town and then meet him on the side of town near the uh, train station. And then we'll go okay. from there when they catch up. Okay. Jesus, Valentine v. Blackwater is a fucking... It's a load of fucking dynamite with a fuse lit right now. No, Prem, yeah, 100%. Woodman steps the fuck up. Woodman steps the fuck up at its times, and it's really fucking awesome. Oh, did you get your package? No. It's all right. We got. I got time. Okay. Uh, even tomorrow night's fine. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry. So I thought there was enough distance for you to see. I just have to slow down and get my bearings. Todd, are you okay? Todd? Todd? Oh. Well, that, one, that knocked me out for six. Jesus. What the hell? I thought there was enough distance between us for you to see to slow down. Uh. No. Oh. There's, there's literally, there's literally road rules in real life where you ride behind someone, you keep an eye when they slow down. Didn't turn signal. <laughs> Didn't indicate. <laughs> The amount of motherfuckers that don't indicate on roundabouts in that is a fucking nightmare. To be fair, I could have pulled over to the side and said something. I could have. But people need to be aware behind to be watching what the person in front is doing as well. So I think it's both. But whatever. <laughs> Wait, where'd they go? No, I acknowledge that I could have pulled over to the side. I acknowledge that. And I could have yelled something out. I acknowledge that.
Yo, Cam. Thank you for the three in a row. Yeah, I think Jack's, Jack's horse might need a breather. Oh, shit. Okay. Shit, there's already some people ahead here. There, there's some people ahead of us. But yeah, Wolf wants us to go by the bakery, then um, patrol down to the uh, train station and wait for them there. All good. We still do owe oh, Dolores a thousand as well, the fighting. All right. Okay, let's yeah, let's take it easy through town. Get down to the train station. Ask peel, gentlemen. Hey, you get him. You go get Walter's killer, man. What the fuck? What? Walter's Walter dead. Gold is... Yeah. He's 10 feet mean? under. Someone apparently came through dead. here and shot up the town and killed him. When, when was this? No, that's not how it went. Down. Thought y'all would've known. Oh, shy. Well, shout map and Buford knows. Look. But all I know is that Mr. Gold is in a, a coma of sorts. So that's all I all, that's all I really know. And then after that, three people in black came in and just shot the fuck out oh, of Valentine. Look, just saying, boys, look, we don't know exactly what happened, and we really feel for finding you all on the ground in Blackwater. But, uh, we got a oh, lot yeah. of- <laughs> We got a lot of people pointing fingers back that you boys came into Blackwater shooting up stuff. Now, look, we don't- we don't know either way. We just wanted hey, to make- you know how Blackwater works. They all stick together. We know, we know. It's just- just tonight, I please, I beg of you boys, just really just don't go poking any beehives, because- and just if 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 a group comes up in a Valentine tonight, just just take be the bigger people, okay? Be the bigger pe person what you, tonight. What do you mean? They all they done all they done already came through, and they they hurt a bunch of people. people just how really long ago? When did this happen? About what what well, ten to fifteen good. minutes ago, yeah, three people and came while through. While we while oh. we were still dealing with stuff down there, God damn it. Apparently two people well, yeah, in the were playing poker. Yeah, I was sitting over there on Mr. Gold's uh, seat there, just doing my will, and the person came in and told me to get the fuck out of Valentine's. Fuck, six then, people left, down. All right, just... Just you keep your heads down tonight, everybody here, okay? Just, we're trying to keep Blackwater and Valentine calm down. It's just... It's a fuse ready to be lit, and we just... Just, okay, just... It's done being lit already. I'm, I'm thinking that that stick of dynamite's already done being Yeah, long. just please, everybody, just yeah, stay saloon, safe, okay? Keep your bullets. heads down. You're out right here tonight. No, 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 no. Unless they come attacking us, we ain't. That's right. No, that, no, that's that's fair enough. Just, just keep that in mind, please. All good. <laughs> this is. Oh, yeah, howdy, miss. A bad way. Howdy, George. You want to walk with us down to the train station? Sure. We might need a doctor. Oh, Ninja! Ninja, I felt so bad! Like, I know Marcus has got a lot of stress in that, but, like, hearing him, hearing you, hearing Marcus and Dolores argue, I was like, I don't like this! Hello. I don't like Howdy. this! I don't like it when oh, Mum and Dad going. fight. Oh, rocking up. Oh, we gotta get down to the post office, gentlemen. Okay, uh, Wolf, well, Wolf and, Ma Wolf and uh, the Marshal will come. Oh, it just yeah, Ninja. I'm like, I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear Dolores and Marcus fight like arguing against each other. It just like, makes, it makes me really minute. sad. Second. It's like no, I don't. I don't like it. It's too hard. 
<laughs> it's too much. It's like, I quit the Lord of Farm and I can't deal with it. <laughs> we've just, we've seen a lot happen tonight, Miss Wheeler, and we're expecting to see a whole lot more. No, uh, trust me, I've seen patient reports crossing my desk. Yeah, Miss Louise had to treat seven people in Blackwater. Yeah, sounds about right. Uh, Miss, did you, uh, did you attend a, 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 some downed people on the railway just outside here? I only just uh, came in a county. So. Oh, no, all the people. Yeah, um, I'm not sure if you guys heard, but. Oh, no, yeah, you guys were there. Yeah, John Black was saying he got shot outside Blackwater. Um, but. I think they all got picked up, uh, like, you know, resuscitated. Uh, well, it depends what time it is. I can take a look at the reports for you, but some people don't get in um, their reports until after they clock out. No, nah, that's all right. All good. Um, I was just the hoping... only report I've really got detail on is the Walter Gold report. Uh, all good. That's it. Thank you, Miss Silver. Ah, uh, yeah. Wolf said, Wolf, Wolf said to wait here until him and the, and the marshal get here. So we'll just uh, we'll just hunker down. If we hear shots in town, we head on over. But we be we be we be smart about it. it feels Sounds like good. I've walked into a war. Well, good well, thing, good thing you got a doctor. Yeah, I'm just uh, just thinking ahead. It's a very good chance we're going to need a doctor in Valentine soon. But uh, if 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 any word can go out to uh to the other doctors. I wouldn't be surprised if we see more bloodshed in Blackwater than that. But I understand the rest of the country needs help too. Just, that's... Generally, if I send out the word to the Calvary, everyone ro rolls up in about 10 minutes, so we should be fine. It's... It's, yeah, Valentine versus Blackwater at the moment. And as the West Law, we are caught right fucking did, smack bang in the middle of it. Did Walter's uh, injury cause all this? Or was that just part of it? This is a lot of... It's the Hickey Boys... You know, doing their thing. It's it's Black's crew yeah. doing their thing. It's the uh, God knows the friends of the Blackwater Saloon owner, and it's just it's turned into a lot of an eye for an eye. It's just and the retaliations, we're, and, we're, and we're all the law that we've got around at the moment. We, in, when when things get stabilized, if we can, you know, have the idea is, you know, we have people boots on the ground in Blackwater to keep an eye on things while another group patrols, just so we can actually see and hear things, but we just don't have the numbers. We can't have someone sitting there by themselves, and we can't have one person going out on patrol. That's just Mr. asking Hughes? for trouble. Could you uh, take a breath, please? Okay. So, yeah. Pretty, I'll do one pretty, better. Uh, pretty right pretty much this is all we've got tonight in terms of boots in the ground, so there aren't many of us tonight. And like, if we didn't have Cole here, we didn't have Wolf yeah. and Ames, it's just we need these new recruits coming through. We need Sledge back. We yes, need uh, we need the rest of the East Department back. Where is Marcus at the moment? Is he on his way here? Uh, him and Deputy Marshal Ames were finishing up some business in Blackwater, and they told us to come ahead and check the bakery, patrol through town, and then wait here for their arrival. Have I, you bought, had, I bought drinks from the bakery. Have you had specific threats against y'all, or is this just you no, feel it just, in the air? We're just doing it, our job. It, it's kind of looking like a gang war at the moment. Mm. Um, it's well, less I hope the hickeys targeted. lose. Yeah, it's it's less you targeted. The hickeys us, lose. Like. I don't, the yeah, hickeys. The, the hickeys seem to be uh, more on our side than the what? other side. Are you joking me? But no. what, what would you prefer, John Black's crew or the Hickey Brothers? You know what? I know he's a part of John Black's crew. I think I'd rather not John Black. That's, I can't believe I'm saying this. Yeah, that, that's how I look at it. I'd pr I would prefer Gosh. the Hickey Brothers over... Mr. Mr. Gold has been sending me telegrams oh, Jack it over the last few days. You all right, Jack? Oh, yeah, I need a bath. Get into, or I get sick. Bloody Valentine. <laughs> oh, Jack, do, do you want someone to go with you? Todd, you want to go with him real quick? I'm I sure Jack can wash him. himself. But, but what if someone ambushes him in the bath? If he's not back in five D minutes. That's a sheriff order. Go you go watch Harness's back while he has a bath, oh, and you boys get oh, right God. back. Okay. Take the back, right. take the back streets. Go get, shot, go get a, have a bath. Come right back. What? If you get shot. Um, there's, a, there's a robbery at Annersburg, but uh, maybe it's better to stay here. <laughs> I would say staying here oh. is higher priority than a yeah. cash register or a bank. Yeah, I'll just have a look which one it is. 
Um, Walter was sending me a lot of telegrams before this happened. He sent me quite a few today about wolves circling his door, and he feels the same people that got him are the ones after me. So his oh, for intuition sake. has never done me wrong before. Fucking hell. This but is the I'm, worst first I'm, week for a sheriff ever. It'll be fun. I am here to follow orders, and I am here to do my duty, and that's all. Thank you, miss. We're glad to have you. And uh, Cole, Cole, have we have we officially met? Uh, we haven't. I, I know I know who you are, but um, yeah. Um, I'm I've Cole. heard many a good <laughs> thing about you, Cole. Oh, yeah. Thank you. New, newly appointed sheriff, George Hughes of the West, at, oh, at nice your service. You. It's no, I've heard many good things, son. You keep up oh, the good work. Wolf is good. Wolf has nothing but good things to say. Oh, Wolf is I, a, also a very lovely man, and I trust his judgment. Is. So if he speaks highly of you, then I speak highly of you as well. Oh well, thank you. That's honestly the nicest thing I like in my entire life. I'm a very oh, nice person. It's well earned, and I, I was very open with the with Wolf earlier. This that um, you know, even though I've been newly appointed sheriff, I before this, I've never actually had the chance to learn how to be a sheriff from anybody. So I still look to Wolf as a mentor as to how to do this properly. So there's a lot of that going on too, because I just. I, Bowman never George, had the chance. I hope you're going to give yourself some credit. You are in a position because you deserve it. Yeah, I know. I just, yeah, just if, if anyone's wondering what the hell's going on, I, I look to I look to Wolf for guidance. Um, I got a lot to learn from him, so I just I'm just being open with everybody because I just uh, I, I feel like I've been freezing up tonight. I'm no, sure you've been, been handling fun. it super well. <sighs> I'm glad because on the, on the inside, I'm. No, it's. It's it's tough. I was saying to some guy like there's like fifteen or so witnesses. Like it's 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 tough. There's, there's so and everyone's got people. long arms. Six yeah. bodies in the street. Yeah, it's it's nuts. Um, Miss, did you say uh, Walt Gold got threatened by someone? Oh, he doesn't know the whole thing, does he? You poor sweet summer child. Uh, there's um, been this uh, th these things that Walter Gold revealed some secrets this week that some people might not like, and uh, he revealed them to me. And uh, that simultaneously put a target on both of us. I got some anonymous threats. Walter had a lot of threats as well, and then seems to have come to fruition today. I see. I see. So, um, has anyone uh, kind of attacked you guys or, or threatened Not you guys? Not me. Unfortunately, the, the the threat that I got was a riddle, and it was a riddle written by a moron, so it's not solved. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um. Uh. Yeah. I have been very tempted to take that riddle and put it on the uh, the notice board and say twenty dollars to whoever can solve this moron's <laughs> riddle. And I still might, but that might get me some unwanted attention if I called oh. him a moron. Now, Miss Wheeler, just another heads up for you. Um, the when, the okay. incident we had in Blackwater earlier, Miss Dolores was accompanying Mister Dunn when uh, all the Hickey brothers were gunned down. To uh, to uh, from what we've gathered. So, and Miss, what do you mean? So, Miss Marcus Wolf, he attempted to have a civil conversation with Miss Dolores, and let's just say the cut, the crap was cut, and uh, and uh, they may have had a little bit of an argument. So you might, you might get wind of uh, Miss Dolores being not too happy with the uh, law department. Fine. At this point, recently. I trust Marcus and the law department more than I trust Dolores. Just wanted to give you a heads up. She signs my paychecks. She doesn't guide me all the time. Okay. You all right, Jack? You, you got that back? Yeah, well, good. Yeah. Good. Todd, you didn't let him out of your side, did you? Oh, I wasn't going to watch him have a bath. No, but you made sure no one interrupted his bath, right? No. Last thing I need is one of you boys getting fucking taken hostage while you're trying to in take a bath. dying a bath while naked would be very embarrassing as well. Yeah, I don't, I don't want that to happen <laughs> anyway. Also, I would like none of you to get injured in a bath because then I have to pull you out of the bath and it's very embarrassing for everyone involved. Oh, look. Not the most embarrassing thing I've done. It'll be fine. Miss, if I die in a bath, I want you to hide my body and tell no one, all right? Because <laughs> that is so I embarrassing. I bury you in an unmarked What happens place? to you? Yes, please. What happens to your body in a bathtub water. again, uh, Jack? Play-Doh? No fun. Let's once I slip, I once I fell out of a bathtub, fully clothed, out the window and onto the street, <laughs> and I passed out. Where, Mr. Wolf should be here by now. We're going to learn from Blackwater. What? Where? I didn't get. I didn't get it. Uh, this one of the how do I say this? One of the older lights. I got a pink. Uh, yeah, I got yeah. a little pink report thing. <laughs> I that, have was no that the active carrier. I don't know what it is. Me. So. Oh. Oh, we got something, so we might have to go there. 
Shit. Okay. Right. I don't even know how to check those. It's how like do, how do we want to? How do we want to slice this pie? I think you should wait another five minutes. Right near the bank too. Uh, yeah, it was, yeah, it was three minutes ago. Yeah, it was three minutes ago. Wolf's probably George. down there. Shit. Yeah. Jack, who do you want to? Who do you want to take with you? I, oh, don't mind. I'll just get my. Uh... Jack, do you just want coal or do you want tart as well? I thought you weren't going to leave a, a doorman by himself. What? Who am I leaving? No. Um. Jack, do you just want to take coal? Well, it's come along, you can. I'm fine hanging out with George. Two of us should always stick together. Yeah, yeah. Sure. yeah. Okay. No, if Let's you go. feel comfortable, Hotness here, you guys go check that. We'll keep. We'll make sure nothing happens here in Valentine. Uh, Shit. Yeah, three minutes ago, we didn't get the. Uh, the... Some of these. <laughs> no, it, I didn't see it either. <laughs> oh, uh, slash CA. Oh. You guys have that too? Yeah, we have two systems going at the same time. Oh my seems. god, what the fuck? Oh, I didn't, I didn't get notified. Okay? It's, oh it's the oh stalker. <laughs> it's the Valentine stalker. I'll have, I'll have you know, he is coming on to me. All right? Not the other way around. Wait, who is coming on to you? Minister. You want me to sort Minister out? I told him I could make it look like an accident. <laughs> I uh, mean, is that he's already been... Yes, that is. Okay, go time. Burn. What the hell was that? It's your fucking boys. I'm waiting to meet an old friend here and I get dragged out of town by a rope. Who dragged you? Hickey? Hickey, yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm telling you. Sometimes a man needs a dragon. We saw the whole goddamn thing. Boys! I didn't do anything with me. Boys, what did I say before? Gun. About keeping your head down. Uh, you might need a bath, mister. You might get tuberculosis. Now we're, we're seeing you dragon. Now we're seeing yeah, you dragon. Look, it worked. Huge, look, it worked. They're leaving. John, come down See? here for a sec. I told you to take the high ground, goddammit. Not... We did. We removed we the scum. Did. Yeah, we were on a nope. horse. That's pretty high. He's man. still gonna see how low he was? He's now gonna go get God knows who and then come back and shoot up Valentine. No, no, man. Didn't, I, like, didn't they already do that? He told us that we're not allowed in Blackwater, but he said he could be in Valentine. I don't seem fair, you know. 50-50. Well, oh fuck! I didn't... Now hold on. Can we? Can I can implore y'all to just stay, can't, stay calm and not cause any more problems for the doctors? It's I'm getting... not causing any problems. No, I know. Any... I know you probably ain't, but you know reactions yeah, and that interactions and things like speaking, that. Speaking of problems with doctors, like, what, what's what's the go with Dolores right now? I, yeah, run, run. Honestly, I only She's... just trained in, so I have no idea exactly what's going on. Yeah, what's what's well, the go man, with the doctors? Are they allowed to be? Knows. Are they allowed to be directly like involved in a gunfight? Not usually unless we're threatened. You like that, Jed? You like So, because her yeah, friend yeah. shot at us, and when he got put no, down, she, well. she yeah, I believe right. she had a gun out, and she grabbed him while the shooting was happening. Yeah, she not very, worry. Been not very neutral of her. I mean, that is sort of what doctors do. We try to get people out of a situation, no matter who they are and what's happening. But, it, you know, I trust yeah, her judgment. She is my boss. Helping the attackers is kind of weird, which I'm saying. Here's all I can say. Hold up, hold up. She is my boss, and I can't really say much. Ah, okay. But you yeah, are welcome to it. talk to the law about any concerns you have about Dolores. Yeah, we spoke. We spoke to the law down. Yep. Yeah, yeah. No, we are aware. My hands are tied. I am on the she bottom weird. of the toe. It's all good. It's all good. You're all right. Good. Hickey brothers and anyone else who may concern. There are Hickey family now. We Hickey. Got all right, Hickey family. Hickey family and co. <laughs> there is a number of oh, lawmen so... down in Blackwater handling the situation on that end. Myself. Yeah. And my esteemed deputy, Todd Woodman, here will be present in Valentine probably over the next hour or two. So please, if anyone comes into town causing any issues, before you go dragging them through the mud, can you please direct them to either Woodman or myself and we will talk to them? Please. I directed Thank them you. out of town. Yeah, he, he, hey, George, what's your lucky number? 
One, two, three, George, believe it or not. George, we will take the Hickey's Coalition, the Hickey Agenda, or just Team Hickey, if you I'm, I'm prefer. surprised y'all haven't gone to, Tonight, like, I'd really Army. like it to be the Hickey One Pacifists. Day. Oh, I can't promise Look, that. Most of us are going West. to bed now, anyway. Oh, yeah, thank we, God. Yeah, we, we, just got out anyway. of, we just got out of Blackwater anyway, and they're, and they're coming up here now. Like, we're, we're not allowed in Blackwater. All right, if you're, so if you're going to bed, I do advise you do that sooner rather than later then, so we can minimize any traumas. All right, you, we'll, we'll leave Valentine your hands then. I would appreciate that. I think there should be an agreement. You know, we stay I'm just, up I'm here just and saying, they stay down there for no, a while. No, I, I understand that, but these sort of politics take time to establish and, amongst, and, you know, towns. And George, you know, you know John Black's trouble. Yeah, we're going to have to. I know, to, I know we, but we you push me help in your case either. I mean, I, I am We're going to have to probably lash you a few people. To I am a former Valentine resident. Trust me, I know how things work around here, so I would like y'all to be safe. Vote down Hickey for mayor. Last show in one, critting out of town at a time. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> with, the help, with the help of Darnell. One know, minute I'll did. be on the porch in a two lawman circle. Please direct ag agitated visitors to us. Thank you. Oh, All good. Right. Uh, thank you, Mr. Hughes. Right, let's ride home. Let's Fucking go through that. Hell, way. man. That's where they is. Mind if I drive with you, John? Come on, buddy. Looks like we're on Valentine babysitting duties, Todd, for me, the yeah. next hour or two. It's all right, at least porch is comfortable. Yeah. It, this porch feels familiar in a way. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ, this is... See what we got to deal with? And like, how do, how does, how do we, how else do we deal with that? It's not like Todd and I come down, hey, could all, can all of y'all just stop doing that and take off your long arms? It's like, there's like 10 of them. I think the long arm's always going to be a losing battle for you. Tom. Yeah, I, I'm. Until we get more numbers, I'm really just. Though I did remember to take mine off my back as I enter town, so you'll be happy about that. Yeah, one of the good ones. I'm gonna find oh, Dolores I when I see her hers on her back. Todd, so, please. It's it's a, a very delicate not, situation. You're gonna have to talk to, I don't know, who's having Dolores in medical. Shit, you're probably gonna have to talk M to the governor or something about Mr. her, Derek. Mr. Sassy. Hi. Uh, Sassy just is a not. heads up, there's people on the saloon roof. Don't know what they're doing up there. Oh, Probably not no. good things. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> is that Marcus? Oh! oh. Is that Mark? Oh, there they the are. Moment. <laughs> Just get folk up. We were, hey, we were way down to the post the office for you. Sorry, sorry. We were uh, getting folk off the roof, and then uh, we, a bunch of individuals were down on the south side there, so we were keeping an eye on them, making sure it wasn't kind of a, you know, a swoopy swoop type of Appreciate thing. Appreciate it. I'm trying, trying to talk down the hickey boys, and it's just, it's a mess. Oh, it's a, it's a goddamn. on the roof. It's a cuckoo, cuckoo, cuckoo. Tell but, you why. Sounds like the hickey, the hickey, sorry, the hickey family are going to bed soon. So hopefully yeah. tonight gets a little bit more calm down. Hopefully, jeez. Howdy, Marcus. Oh, howdy, Doc. How are you? Yeah, I'm well. I just, I think I've missed a lot tonight. Yeah, this is probably. I locked myself in the saloon room just so I could study for hours, and I came back for this. So. <laughs> well. Fuck yeah! Well, it's probably that's probably a good thing to be honest. Honestly, uh, especially in Blackwater, especially in Blackwater. Yeah. Oh, uh, Harkness and Cole headed down there. W w did you happen to see him on the way up? No, no. Oh, came by us, probably. Shit. Yeah, no. Harkness and Cole went down. They figured you might still be down there dealing with something. No, no. We went to uh, yeah, we went to Strawberry because uh, we went we we come up behind the group, you know, and uh, we, we decided to go to Strawberry just in case. Oh God! Um, that, that's good that we're spread out. At least uh, your deputy um, is with my deputy, so that's the main thing. And yeah. I'm here as a requested pocket doctor. So. What did they they requested a doctor? I think George thinks he's gonna get. Oh, hurt. we uh yeah we got into town and Miss Wheeler was here, so we we uh, advised her to accompany us for yeah, no, uh, everyone's absolutely. safety. Yeah, I no, have my absolutely. forceps prepped already. Oh, the forceps. Yeah, good, good, good. How do we how do we want to play this now? Because yeah, Todd and I could uh, hang out up here for a, you know the next better part of an hour. All right, 
And me and the marshal, we could swoop back down towards Blackwater, maybe just um, just have a check on, and uh, maybe then uh, make our way to Rhodes. Yep, yep. Did you want to, uh, <laughs> if you get a moment, Something. Um, Todd and I will try and keep looping, doubling back to the uh, the office here. If you wanted to call us when everything's all clear in Blackwater, we can go from there. All right, sounds good. Yeah, all right. I'll call the uh, I'll call the office here, right? And then, um, and then yeah, if uh, what and then what you would then you just stay here or you're gonna move on? From here? Oh yeah, once once you feel the Blackwater situation, you've got a grasp on it and what you want to do next. Just yeah, give us a call and uh and uh, we'll uh, come up with a game plan. Yeah, yeah. Because if we can if we can even stick to uh, where the phone lines reach, that'd be good. Because then we can just keep uh, using the phones as uh, kind of the way it means to kind of you know rally up. Because yeah, we, if you need us to come down there or whatever works. Because yeah, we yeah we're up here. We're just hoping to keep it quiet. But Blackwater, yeah. fucking, there could be a shootout happening down there right fucking now. Yeah, true. All right, well we'll uh, we'll get down there and we'll check on the deputies and we'll give you a ring uh, when we do a, we'll do a light patrol around the streets and then we'll we'll go in and check in. Appreciate oh, yeah. it. We'll uh, we'll make All sure right. the mud doesn't overflow the town here. In the meantime. Yeah, I'm already looking forward to going. It's great. <laughs> I can't. Well, wait. you're actually looking cleaner now that it's been raining tomorrow. I know. I muddy. was just I was just feeling like the, the mud was was coming off me there because I <laughs> silly me, you know. Yeah, I, I think the the effects of that bottle of whiskey I drank was still kind of lingering there. Oh, yeah. I yep. couldn't believe that. I, I, it was because of the little bit of opium. Then you just had the whiskey on top, and you just I said <laughs> have a sip of whiskey, and you just threw up back the whole bottle. That's kind of your on your own. I didn't even mean to. I didn't mean to. It just yep. it, it went down so easy, and I was like, "Because your tongue was numb, you didn't know how much you were drinking." Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I don't and how, how are you feeling though? How's your arm? It's good. It's good. You know, uh, I, I, I tried the long arm today, but uh, you know, I mean, it, it hurt. It hurt. That's why I got it off. I had to shoot someone um, in Saint Denis, unfortunately, because mm -hmm. well, oh. they thought that Miss Nadine was there. It's after oh, all that, yeah, and, yeah, yeah. No, that's Miss Nadine was not there. So, yeah, the buck, the bucks, and my shotgun was so they could have that. <laughs> but you know, anyway, you know, Miss Nadine's fine. I'm fine, but yeah, I'm. I'm. That was that was that was it. Unfortunately, you know that I I, I can't I can't I'm, I'm not gonna pull that out again today that's uh no that's like, the kickback can hurt you a lot oh it did yeah it's yeah. Uh, it's just insane that you're uh you don't miraculously recover like a lot of people do and walk away from things really we, we need to find out what they're on hmm. maybe i should have taken you up on that cocaine paste thing <laughs> that that is probably it you know i usually give it a, give that a, to people a lot so and I tell you, that gentleman in Rose, you know, when he was on, he was on that cocaine. He was, he was that fast. Mr. Hughes, I caught someone on uh, with some cocaine. Okay, he was running around the town so quick, everywhere, right? What is everywhere. he having his own I, supply? Well, that's, I, I was thinking, what the hell is this gentleman doing? Like he was running in and out of doors, in the bank, in and out, you know, round and round, 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 statue and roads. And I'm thinking, what the mm -hmm. hell? Mm -hmm. So yeah, detained him, you know. Um, and, you Actually, know, have you heard from Dex? Because Dex got really? shot twice within like five minutes and had really remember he, at Blackwater. He was down when I got there, and then the then the robbery happened, and he got shot again. Anyway, it was the first time no, I had to do a patient I, report for the same person twice. You know? No, I, have, I haven't seen him since. Why is there a squirrel in my right. pocket? Uh, what's his last name? Again? Jack, Dax, Indiana, or Jack's Indiana. Yeah, Dax, Indiana. Yeah, Dax, one Indiana. of our new boys. Where's he from? <sighs> God. Can't say for sure, but he seems like a. He's he reminds me a bit of Cole. He's a, mean, one of the good new ones. What do you ones. mean though? Where, where did he come from? I don't Texas. know. No, he didn't. Maybe Indiana. No, oh, that could be right. When when did he do his training? Oh, I think a month ago. But I think he might have uh, had training in another county. Oh, okay. I think and he might he be one of those. Right. Where did he come through the Rangers, or was he already a, a, um, a department member? I think he was a very early department member, and then he had uh, matters to take care of for a couple of weeks. But he's been on our ledger for a long time. Yeah, okay. No, no, that's fine. All right, well, I hope he's doing well, because, yeah, two shots within 10 minutes, two shots of morphine is not great. Uh, it'd be that mustache that'd be keeping him safe, I guess. I think so. Yeah, I think it has holds a bit of power or something. All 
I think at this point uh, it might be an idea in the future to start doing checkups on the lawman every so often. What? What do you mean? We're fine. Nothing no, ever happens like to us. A, a None of y'all come in for routine appointments. Some of y'all probably have like heart conditions and stress. Oh, and we just, we just, oh, yeah, we just yeah, built yeah, we different. Would. Yeah, we, we, just, think... we just get on with I it, you know. And smoke. Yeah. Well, yeah. I do as well, so. Yeah, yeah I go. Actually, well, I, I don't. Oh, well, that is a surprise, Todd. That's good. <laughs> All right, let's uh, yeah, let's do that. Uh, Marshall, yeah, we'll, uh, if if that's okay with you, we'll we'll head to uh, Blackwater and then uh, do yeah. We'll, uh, we'll be yeah, waiting by the phone. All right, yeah, fantastic. Yep. All right, keep safe, y'all. You too. Godspeed. Fucking the West is on fire tonight, and we don't have enough people. Looks like they did end up leaving town. I'm gonna head over to the the, the uh, bakery and grab something. To eat. Oh, I will come with you. There is one thing, though. If we ever have to, um, I'll talk to you in a second. Howdy, ma'am. Hello. Hands to yourself, ma'am. Sorry. You heard me. You, hands to What'd yourself. You <laughs> Excuse me. He is coming on to me, not the other way around. Thank you. Oh, you, you two better settle that. Nonsense! Did out. you get that report, George? Yeah, where's that? How, how do we? How do we look at that? Oh, sent it in. It's not our problem. Just yeah, just miss. Just yeah. Come on. No, no. Come on. No. Come on. No, 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 no. That wasn't me. Are you leading him on? No, I've told him. I've told him I'm not interested in that. Well, Miss Miss Wheeler, the doctor down there, like says that uh, you gotta you gotta be really clear with these things. Like a uh, uh, you gotta advise. Do you think me saying that uh, like you know uh, I'm interested in well is more more than enough? I mean, that's if he fucking survives, I guess. But so you've told that to Minister? Yeah. And uh, do you he mind knows. me asking uh, why you're interested, in Mr. Gold? No, no uh, offense. Because I like being around him. Do you? That's. <laughs> Yeah, oh. I think he's fun. Yeah, you don't know what. Yeah, each day's different. <laughs> well, look to each their own. Um, look, I have fun when I'm around him, so you know, I think that's enough. Do other people have fun around him? Uh, I don't know. Do they? No. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I don't know. All right, well, yeah, whatever makes you happy, Miss. Just. Just like I said, stop stalking, Minister. I didn't stalk him. Oh, what? Next he time he tells I... you one thing once, and then you believe him. I can't believe it. He's got a he's got a very uh, important looking hat. Oh, what about my hat? It's not it's as tall. It's not as tall. It's, I mean, it's not, but it's yeah, but it's a nice. It's a good look you're going for. I can see there's a bit of a theme. Go on there. What, what's the theme? Uh, is that like a, a, a cyan? <laughs> like an aqua? I just think it's blue, really. Oh, yeah, but you know, there's a whole family of blues. You know, you got cyan, aqua. Is teal one, or is that in the green family? Never mind. I don't know. But yeah, never, never mind, ma'am. All right, well, yeah, just stay safe. I mean, uh, easier said than done when you get fucking blown to bits in front of okay. someone else's door. Good job, yeah. Are we still talking about Mr. Gold? Uh, Is he the oh one blowing you to bits? No, no. <laughs> no, I don't know who they were. No. Did you get shot as well, ma'am? <laughs> I did, I got shot. <laughs> Are you doing well now? I hadn't seen your patient report across my desk yet. Oh, hasn't it? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling much better, obviously, so, a bit sore. You know what? That's to be expected. Ma'am, would you like Mr. Gold to blow you to bits? I don't know what you mean by that. Um, Mr. Gold is currently... In a respectful way. Well, <laughs> listen, maybe when he's not in a coma. Okay. He's not in a coma. Mr. Gold, is, uh, he had emergency brain surgery and he is in a coma. Uh, which is a, a chemically induced state yeah. to help his brain repair. The so OFL, thanks for the rain. We'll news. Okay. This is getting so dumb. Yeah. Sorry, ma'am. I, I, I misspoke. I'm just, I'm just trying to make light, <laughs> funny conversation. 
It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Let me know. Let me know if he uh, does wake up. Oh, you, nice you, you could probably wake him up. <laughs> sure, he's not even in there. So he's been oh. moved. Oh, you just. Maybe for his own protection, but you know. He has been moved. We have different care locations that we keep patients in longer term. Uh, Blackwater is more suited for longer term patients, but Valentine is not. So he would have been oh, evacuated kinda... by the local doctor. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, I can't imagine why Valentine wasn't on the top of that list. <laughs> so you could uh, you could find where they're keeping him, and then you could, uh, you know, get down, whisper something nice in his ear like, <laughs> Mr. Gold, they're cutting your uh prices at the other gun stalls. And you're saying in a really oh. nice, and then he'll jump up. Well, I will be attending to Mr. Gold as much as I can, so I will keep that in my back pocket as well. That is a good line. <laughs> like, uh, Mr. I, Mr. Gold, there's a do you reckon there's a new gang in country that you haven't pissed off yet. And he'd be like, yeah. <laughs> quick, <laughs> out I the door. Just, I will enter the room and I will put my hands up and oh. yell, Valentine's oh, in the patrol, and he should, you know, wake up. Oh. <laughs> Is that Ato? Oh, uh, Sheriff Hughes. Mr. Hinto, good to see you. Uh, good to see you too. Uh, your phone is ringing. Oh! I told your sheriff. The phone! We meant to make the phone! I'm not sure uh, it was ringing quite loudly. Uh... We meant to be waiting on the phone! Whoops! And here I am making funny chat with Ellie, is it? Whoops. <laughs> oh, hello. How you going? How you going? Uh, it's quiet. How's it down there? <laughs> it's quiet. You, you, you're going to come up here? No worries, Fatal. Oh, Marcus and uh, Ames have headed down there. Yeah, so yeah, just wait from there. They're going to call us when everything was quiet and down down there as well. Oh, you've seen a friend? You... you Okay, of course. Yep. Okay, what? Okay, did you get a photo? Okay. All right. Okay, bye. <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, that was Jack. It's quieting down. Wolf is not up there yet. Oh, God. Thank God. Hopefully, hopefully the road's safe for him. But, uh, but, uh, Todd, uh, Cynthia, have you met, uh, Mr. Hinto here? I have Hello. met Mr. Hinto. Remember, I bumped into you while you were Hello? doing a... Oh, oh yes. yes. I remember Before him. he took you to a teepee, remember? Oh, yeah, the teepee time. That was fantastic. But, yeah, Mr. Hinto, this is uh, Todd Woodman, also with the West Law. Hello. Hello, Mr. Woodman. Yeah, what do you What do? You do? Uh, uh, the chief of uh, Wapiti. Oh, okay. He's doing some uh, ride-alongs with us. Oh. So if you ever see him, bring him along. Because uh, oh, okay. they want to set up their own law department up there one day. Their yeah, own what? Yes, I was meaning to tell you, Mr. Hughes, uh, it is, uh, the building is now built, and uh, I've taken your advice on some of the laws, and... Uh... Oh, good. Well, yeah, we still got plenty more to cover. That's, that's glad to hear that uh, progress is still being made. Well, George, are you all right? Why are you coughing? <laughs> Sorry, yeah, you know, I always get a tickle in my throat. Huh. One day we'll have to have an appointment. The other with night, maybe. Well, mm -hmm. he does oh. like a peace pop, apparently. What? No, no, I'm more of a cigarette man. I heard that he uh, saw a wolf. Ah, uh, yes, the spirit of the wolf. Uh, I thought he was more of like an otter or a beaver, but wolf is, yeah, that makes sense, I guess. Oh, no, my name is Hughes. <laughs> I know, Mr. Hughes. We're talking about your spirit animal, mm -hmm. remember? Oh, yeah, 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 no, it's definitely a wolf. Yep, yeah. I just felt it. I just oh, uh, felt it, all right. I, I just figured as much. You know, always. Uh, I, have, I have been told that my spirit animal is a fox. Maybe I'll have to come find out one day. 
Hmm? Yes, you must uh, come and find out. Oh, how? Yeah. Oh, I wouldn't know about. I wouldn't know about how you find out. But you know, if there's ways to find out, then I think that's of great. Yeah. <laughs> well, this is riveting conversation. Well, you have to come and find out again. There are people riding in. Who's it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We better. We better get out into. Oh, it's Skylar White. She's gonna pass out. Skylar White. <laughs> Same with you, Woodman. If you ever uh, want to find out your spirit animal, come up to my TP one day. Uh, okay. Well, if it's quiet for a bit longer, I suppose we could all go up. If, uh, I, don't know, I don't know if tonight's the right sort of night for it, George. I know, I'm just saying that if it keeps quiet, we could consider it. George is hankering for a peace pop. No, no. I just, I would just like to get away from Blackwater and Valentine. I am just it's from time with to you. time. It's uh, called addiction. Sorry? No, no. I, I just want to get out of Valentine and Blackwater. And I would love to know that uh, uh, Miss that Miss Wheel is spirit animal is the beaver. Oh, I don't think it's a beaver. I'm calling it that it's going to be a beaver. I don't think that's right. Maybe one of them many soul squirrel souls. I kill a lot of squirrels. I don't want to be one. <laughs> oh, fatigue. Oh, my God. And we're like, we've got three lawmen Maybe on duty. <laughs> and we're like bouncing between Valentine and Blackwater like, ah! <laughs> please, everyone, calm down. There. Please put the guns away. Please, for the love of God, just everyone chill the fuck out. God, I do love desert dust chicken. Has anyone else tried desert dust chicken? No. It really hits I, the spot. I usually have beef Wellington. Uh, that's quite the uh, chicken you have there. Oh, I just, you know, pull it out of my pocket. Wolf it down. Pound the pun. Oh please, fatigue! I wish people would stop busting. We down don't even have the, the we don't have the numbers to deal there. with that. <laughs> like we'd just be on the They're the sides, the like the stop, stop doing that, please, don't do that, stop. Like we're all gonna die. We're <laughs> suddenly very outnumbered. Hmm. Who are they? who are they? We've got three there. We've got one up there on the beam. We've got one in the doctor surgery. We've got a couple down the end of the street. You we want me to find out what's going on? Uh, Excuse me, guys. Howdy. Howdy. How do I get the food crafting timer off my eyes? It's froze right uh, now. Try going oh. into the stables, like actually going into the stable master. Apparently that right. sometimes helps. Oh. Hello? The stable man knows how to cook food. Ah. Oh, who's this guy? Excuse me. Oh, howdy. Howdy. Where, where do I wash myself? Uh, at the the bathhouse, the end of the street, at, on the left there, the one that's got the blue and the white. And uh, thank you, man. A mask off in town, please. Just just so people feel safe. <laughs> thank you, partner. I think so, Cam. I I I haven't had a look at the numbers or anything. Also, I was wondering if there's uh, any bounties. Oh, I think currently not in the west because uh, they're expensive. I'm afraid. Okay. Maybe next month. Thank you very much. <laughs> George, you are a very tense man right now. You need to yes, take a deep breath. Very in. tense. I, it's, I'm, it's it's a very it, there's a lot on my plate as sheriff. There's a lot to be thinking about, and All right. I still haven't a chance to have more sit downs with any of the other lawmen because just shit's always hitting the fan. Maybe you need a peace pipe. Hmm? Uh, oh, no. Uh, I'm, I'll, I'll just have a cigarette, thank you. <laughs> do, do, right, Gold? It's... Well, you know, I came in, I was promised action, haven't had a suit you one person yet. Good. I will not say the word. Oh, hey, it's the other doctors. Hey, Louisa. Hey, hey, William. Hi. How you doing? 
Have you, has things calmed down now? There was another mass shooting here. I believe someone was running around. Look, I, I, I think it's fine. I think okay. it's fine. Well, yeah, seems to be no one shooting at the moment, so that's that's probably good. Yeah, yeah, and let's let's just leave that topic at that. Yeah. Um, if okay. uh, if you see Minister Creed, have Cynthia check his hand. Oh, I, I had to sew it back on. Oh God! Oh yeah. yeah. Cut his hand off. It it was a bullet. Jesus. Did you get that, Miss Wheeler? I did. Partial sever. I'll check out All the right. patient report. Okay. okay. You take care, everyone. Bye. Why couldn't he? He saw you here, right? Why didn't he just tell you? William and I are not exchanging words at the moment, unless it's to do directly with work, which he should have told me that himself. Uh, Boy, is that but... he drinks? No, Will. We have agreed not to talk about each other, so I will not say anything further. Well, what happened now? I'm not allowed to talk about it. Wait, maybe you told me the last thing that happened. You telling that more happened since then? Yes, sir. Oh, was he drinking? Like Todd said, was he drinking again? I cannot talk about it. Did he? He didn't threaten you or anything, did he? I can't talk about it. You can talk to him about it if you want. Uh, we have just have professional courtesy and that's all. That I wish that wagon had a professional courtesy with that building. Oh, it's gone. Fucking hell. So who's keen for Taco Tuesday tomorrow? I am apprehensive about Taco Tuesday. What's that mean again? Nervous about Taco Tuesday? Oh, nervous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, me too. Uh, did you say you don't know what a taco is, Ato? Uh, wait, wait. Yes, uh, Ato, you have corn? You have corn, is. right? You can grind, grind the corn into corn flour and make like a little flatbread and then you put meat in it and that's a taco. Got it. Uh, Got it. Uh, okay. And it, people like it because it's like convenient to eat. You put the meat and the cheese and like the vegetables and stuff in in the the corn tortilla is what they call it. And then uh, then you got a taco. Much better than cornbread. Cornbread is delicious. You got to stop hating on cornbread. I don't like it. Sorry to intrude, but would Sorry. any of you fine people know how to equip a second pistol? I brought purchased it. I have a holster, but I don't seem to know how to equip it. Oh, uh, maybe maybe unequip the first one and then try uh, left, uh, using your left click muscle on both once you've uh, done that. I'll give that a go. Thank you. Howdy, Howdy, Howdy Miss Carter. Sorry, man, or something. No, no, not at all. We were just talking about cornbread, so. Ah, ah. And there tacos. Oh. How and how that? they are superior to the cornbread. Oh. I like cornbread. I anyway, to go on. Uh, the guy from the east. Oh no, um, I'll that talk to you later. Perfectly. Thank you. Uh, no, I am. I'm available if you need a quick discussion. Okay, yeah, if you don't mind. Sure. Oh. Don't stray too far, ladies. Is now I'm a real cowboy. That's yeah. it. Now you get the spirit. Uh, I do it. Well, you need to be very skilled, apparently. Ado, did you tell me what your spirit animal is? Oh, yes, it's the, uh, the badger. Oh, that's right. No, you did. Sorry. It'd be great to find out what Todd and Cynthia's spirit animals are. Oh, Mr. Woodman. Oh, don't. Fatigue, you can, you can go up to Wapiti and smoke opium. With the Native Americans and find out. Clint Eastwood, what? C3. I. Uh, what? <laughs> it, it's a George Hughes' animal is a wolf. 
He, but, but that, don't, I'm not, but George didn't have to smoke opium. He never, George Hughes has never smoked opium since becoming sheriff. Never, ever, ever. Not, didn't happen. George Hughes definitely didn't smoke opium in a TP as sheriff and find out that his spirit animal is a wolf. Didn't happen. Did not happen. <sighs> Look at this horse. This is a very bold That's horse. Pretty quiet, huh? Very. We're not proceeding on any or This is a very. Proceeding? Look at that. Are you not receiving any crimes? No. Mondays, am I right? No, it's been like that all night. Mm. The crime thing. Well, I guess it's our good thing then. Shut up, Dill. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> ah! Don't you say the words! I swear to God. I swear to God. I will. I will end you. I will goddamn end you. Do quiet, huh? Hello, distinguished lawman. Had it. A Valentine. Hi. I, I, I was wondering have any of y'all seen Mr. Mr. Gold Gold around? No. 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 Okay. Okay. He's 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 been trying to reach me these last couple couple days, <laughs> and I, I, I I'm trying to find him. He uh. Yeah. Strawberry blacksmith. Am I? No, no, no. I'm I'm the Commodore of the Legal Eagles and Beagles. Fucking Com Commodore? Yeah, yeah, I'm the Commodore. Wait, is the bin man? Speaking the English. Yes. Is I'm also a lawyer. Oh. Right. I I, I found a a law book in one of the bins, and it had a meat stain on it, and I and I studied real hard, and I got hi hired on at the Legal Eagles and Beagles. Yeah. Right. Um. Uh. So. Uh. So, Mister Gold. Uh. It yes. seems word on the street is that he uh may be undergoing some medical treatment. So if he's not here, oh. he may be at a a medical infirmary in a large town like Blackwater or Saint Denis. That that's all oh. we've heard. Oh well, I I shall investigate. It looks like there are some doctors over there, and I will go pick their medical brains. Sure. All right. Well, I appreciate. No, no problem. <laughs> Take care. Okay. <laughs> oh. Look at him. I uh, just needed a stretch. Oh. Oh wow! Would you look at that? <laughs> just. Oh, hey, 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 hey! Oh, sorry. Every time I come on, I come on, we. Our peoples are peaceful now. Come on, leave that in the past. We gotta move I'm forward sorry, together we'll... as one. Get back to stretching. <laughs> Much better. That does look kind of peaceful. <laughs> oh no. Oh, I'm getting the giggles tonight. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Whew. Oh. <laughs> You saw nothing. P pardon? Oh, oh yeah. Hey. Huh? 
You all right, Todd? Hey, yeah. Why? Well, what's going? On? Oh, just, just checking. You're all right. Oh, you know what I've just realized. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, no. No, never mind. Miss Will, why have you gone back mm -hmm. to a skirt? I have got a few different outfits. I'm trying to look more professional. All right. Just I'm here I can stalk. Sorry. I am entirely focused on my Hey, 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 hands yourself. Oh, she has long arms. Get her, Hughes. <laughs> I'll just stand over here. Back, Siren! Back to the waters! Siren, here's you interested in her? No, she. Do you feel like your rights no. have been violated and you need to open a court case? No, yes. She, she's a. She's interest. She's a. She's a. Putting in a court order to Mr. Gold. Oh. All right then. Uh, she seems nice. She's 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 real pretty. She's really tall. Um, I just yeah, the stalking allegations is a no, bit off putting. George, though. if you like her, I you know just go talk to her. Oh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. She's eyeing you up and down in those binoculars. Oh, I wouldn't. I don't. I don't really know her. She seems nice, but yeah, she's interested, in Mr. Gold, and uh, I, I ain't a, go say hi to. Her. I ain't a home wrecker. Go on. I ain't gonna. I ain't gonna go, come go between. On. I ain't gonna. I don't even know her fucking name. He's talking me. Why don't you, He's why don't you ask me. her name? Sorry. Todd, what did you do? I looked at her binoculars. Ma'am, George here doesn't even know your name. Could you have an actual introduction, please? No, it's Ellie, isn't it? Yeah, it's Ellie. Thank you. Now, what was your last name? Ridley. Ellie Ridley. Okay, yeah. So I'm bad How with names. How did you remember her name and it took you like three days to remember mine? My... Less letters. This is true. I don't have any letters. No, I see where I stand, George. It's fine. <laughs> you want me to... Okay, well, I mean, he's wearing a vest right now, but when he's not wearing a vest, you want me to... handle him? No, oh, no, don't! I, I don't know what that means. What did I just say? Yeah, I just, yeah, you should do that. I just said, hands yourself. Stop. Stop uh, stalking people. I don't people. see no lore against that. I, don't I see feel no I am uncomfortably standing between you two flirting. I'm going to sip over here. I'm not... I'm not flirting. I'm not flirting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You're gonna get me in trouble. What? No such thing. <laughs> fucking hell. Where's this phone call? Ring the fucking phone. <laughs> We're gonna be standing on this porch forever. <laughs> oh my god, boy. <laughs> She's coming back. Feeling a little bit weird right now. Why? Uh, everything kind of is spinning and slowing down. Have you? Have you? Are you hydrated? Yeah. Have you had a? Do you need a it's, cigarette? It's like my head is funny. Like I don't know. Do you need a cigarette? I no, I don't need. I'm completely not stressed. You hungry? No. Nope. Need some uh, peace pipe. <laughs> No, I just need to, uh, I think... Do you need a bath? Chill. You can, uh, you can take I a mean, knee on a porch if you want. No, it's gross and dirty. You, you're here. kneeling in the mud! <laughs> What's wrong with our porch? <laughs> Do you know how many lawmen have stood on what, this porch in a circle over the years? What's wrong, what's wrong with her? Is she uh, a bit tired? She's a bit dizzy or something. Um, oh. just, yeah, ooh. You know what helps? Here we go. Peace what? pipe. A uh, little stretch. little stretch. Oh, yeah, yeah. Check this out. Yes. <laughs> this is the native dance. Oh, my of goodness. My village. <laughs> Beautiful. Very <laughs> 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 creative, aren't they? It's oh, you should. Well, Petey's a great place. A lot of nice folk up there. I once went Hello up there. and uh, hung out in a teepee. A teepee. Yeah, I found out that my spirit animal is a wolf. Yeah, thanks I don't to that, thanks too. to Mister Hinto Look over the there. On that. The the peace uh, the 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 Native Americans do not lie. 
Can I just say my hat is still in the mud over there from when I got fucking blasted with a shotgun? Oh, oh whoa! Hey, hey! You all right? No. Oh, now you need a bath. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I think you could use a little. I. Yeah, come with me. I need a bath first. <laughs> 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 the face by hard. Had it. So. Did you see Mr. Hinto's dance? Yeah, I how did he do that? Oh, it's it's the uh, Wapiti dance. So. Yeah, poor Miss uh, poor Miss Ridley was uh, feeling a bit dizzy or something. Yes, All right. I, I'm yeah. going to show her when she gets back because uh, she looks like she really needs it. It's a good distress. Look, I, if I if I was a lady interested in Walter Gold, I'd be stressed too. I'd probably be more stressed than how I currently am as a sheriff. Walter and I are very close friends, and I'm already stressed out. I think all of Valentine is stressed. Mm -hmm. Todd, they still they remember that they got to call us, right? I hope so. Unless they got like shot up or something going there. Fuck. Why don't you call them? The phone oh, works both yeah. ways. That, but Wolf said he'd call us. Oh, you should you should call them. That's Jeb and Lily. Oh yeah, it's Jeb the, the killer, isn't it? Hey, 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 Shut no, up, don't man. fucking, don't say what? that. What? He's just doing his job. He was just doing his job. Killer. He put down criminals, that's, oh no! <laughs> Are you all right? Yeah, I'm fine. I'm just gonna have a bath for a second. Yeah, time. holy! <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, Todd, you boy. shouldn't laugh at that. She could get oh, that sick. Was, that was, it was looking hilarious from that angle. You gotta admit, it was pretty funny. She would laugh if it happened to me. <laughs> no, you're absolutely right. You 100. percent She she would. She'd actually probably light a cigarette and smile. Morning, yeah. Howdy, Jeb. Hello. Uh, do either of you guys have quite a lot of room in your bags? Oh, uh, I, I, I guess. Right, let me see if this works. Jeb, Jeb, Jeb. Yep, there you go. Those are 100% illegal, and I found them. So, what was it? A underground distillery. What are these oh, parts for? I, I found one. Did you find one of those in a box as well? Yeah, they're to make moonshine, so we oh. catch people with them. Okay. Oh, uh, the phone. Yeah, get oh. phone. Yeah, I found one in a box. I didn't didn't know what to do. With it, so and they're put it illegal. In my nah, they're illegal, Mr. Woodman. Valentine Sheriff's Office. This is Sheriff George Hughes speaking. Sheriff Hughes. This is uh, Sheriff Marcus Wolf from. Calling you from the Blackwater Sheriff's Office. Oh, glad to hear from you. You too, partner. You too. Uh, everything's good here. Uh, there was a uh, quite a few folk in town, so you know we were just going through and checking who's who in the zoo. Uh, so yeah, you know. Um, but before uh, before we leave, I think uh, we might we might stick around for a little bit longer because uh, yeah, our our, uh, our ghost has been seen. So oh. Uh, copy that. Well, it, yeah. it is. It has been awfully quiet up here in Valentine since y'all left. Uh, do you think we should come on down, or what, what do you think? Absolutely, partner. If there ain't, if there ain't nothing, yeah, if there ain't nothing going on in Valentine, I'd say uh, you know have a sniff by a strawberry on the way back here, and then check those plane lands and make sure ain't folk ain't uh, ain't hunting those bison because a few folk been uh, pulling up some bison horns. So. Oh, disgusting! What well, great minds think alike. I was thinking that we'll probably swing by a strawberry flat neck. Buy some planes and head on down to Blackwater. We'll see Go you on, soon. Partner. We'll wait here for you. Thanks, Wolf. We'll see you soon. Thank you, partner. See ya. Giddy up. What a guy. All right. It's a. It is a. It's all clear uh -oh. down in Blackwater, but they're just sticking around for a time. So, uh, yeah, Wolf agrees that uh, now would be time we might uh, head hit the. Uh, 
get on our horses, head through Strawberry, mm -hmm. Flatneck okay. Station, the Barson Field, down to Blackwater, okay. and uh, okay. we'll regroup with them there. Did you want to come with right. us, Mr. Hinto? Good morning, sir. Uh, yes, yes, I would love to. We'll see if uh, Miss Wheeler wants to come as well, just so we got medical backup. All right, we'll go to Flatneck first. Never come. That's good. Uh, so, sorry we, to interrupt, we'll Miss Wheeler. We're heading to Blackwater with a few stops on the way if you wanted oh. to join us. Sure, I will come with you. You two stay safe. You too. Bye bye. Bye. See you, Jeb. See you, Lily. Bye. All right, to Flatneck. Goodbye, Valentine. Sorry, me talking a bit early made you uncomfortable. No, I didn't make me uncomfortable. Just didn't want to. Just didn't want to. Uh, anyone to get the wrong idea? I, I, I've only just met her. No, I know. Hey, Kemp, we, we, we can't. I am uh, very intentionally trying not to. We can't um, or tease anyone at the moment or no, it's ever fine. again, to be honest. So we can't. Um, you can't invite people habits, through you know. Twitch chats or Discords and stuff because that would be meta gaming. Oh, I'm not, and you, and you better! You better! Were you, were you teasing, William? No, I wasn't. What the hell did you do to that boy? Uh, I existed, remember? And I can't talk about it. I promise, and I'm trying to keep the promise, even if he makes me really angry. Is there any, is there any criminal activity involved, or anything that the law should know? No, I don't think so. Keep your eyes peeled, everybody. There was a couple of criminals down here the other night, and they stole my shotgun. Maybe one day I'll be allowed to tell you again, but he is a firm believer that me confiding into my friends about my feelings means I'm a gossip, so I cannot speak about things. All right, well, I wouldn't want to make William uncomfortable, but I just want to make sure you're okay. It's fine. I'm going to focus on my job. I'm going to be professional. I'm sober. I haven't had a cigarette in 24 hours, which is really hard, and I am focused on my care of my patients. And I am not going to let the doom and gloom of somebody potentially trying to kill me ruin my day. Now, someone trying to kill you, that's not William, right? Well, it isn't a great riddle. Yeah, I was passing through here the other day. And a couple of fellas were resting. So I stopped and I asked if they were alright. Next thing I know, they lasso me, pull me to the ground, and they're trying to steal all my shit. When did this happen? Saturday night, just after I saw you and Shuba. Uh, you're kidding. Literally you come, within a minute after leaving you and Shuba, I got I got mugged right around here. Oh, I'm sorry, George. No, it's all right. I saved the serial number, so I'll pass that on to gunsmiths and that in due time. But it's all right. You know, sh pump action shotgun ain't too expensive. I'll get a new one. All right, we'll go to Strawberry next. Oh, Dill, that's rough. No, everyone, stop saying it's quiet. You're going to get us killed. I'm quite shocked that it's been so quiet since I came on you. This, oh. this would oh, have been no. the night to call out a rattle, a snapping turtle. I just said the word. Wait, what'd you do? I said the Q word. Jesus Christ. I, d I don't know what happened. It just slipped out. Uh, 
I take it back, God, if you can hear me. I take it back. No, ninja. No! I, I, will, I cannot accept that Dolores does anything like that. Never! Never! It's not real! That's not true! That's impossible! No! No! Search your feelings. You know it to be true. I need a counter for every time someone says, Quiet! <laughs> <laughs> also, Shorty, thank you for the follow. Howdy, partner! Also, sorry, yeah, but a, a whole bunch of people have followed earlier tonight. Oh, so the extent of the William thing is I've decided to pretend he doesn't exist unless it's directly related to a patient I'm currently caring for. Cynthia, that's very extreme. Well, he's he started it, and I, that sounds really immature, but he did say that he doesn't want to speak to me, like, ever again, so... But he, fo he followed the procedure. He told you his intentions, as your people do. You gave him an answer. And then he decided to then escalate him. Well, he was drunk. And then he brings it up again when he should just be letting it go. And I imagine you then, you know, dealt with it again. So it is kind of... That's right. He needs to stop. He's, he's, he's stated his intention. I want to talk about it, but I can't. I can't talk about it. I'm not trying to get anything out of you. I'm no, just saying. I, I can't, though. He needs to stop. And move on. Also, thank you for the subs in that early in the bits. Sorry, it's just... There's been so much... Like, I, I, I feel bad interrupting the RP. So, sorry if... if sorry I didn't, if I didn't acknowledge anything earlier. I do apologize. I wasn't meaning to ignore anyone. It's just sometimes it's hard, like, as, as a sheriff now, and with everything going on, it can be hard to get a quiet moment. It's, it's, it's uh, peaceful here as well. You know, the other day I was treating somebody here for a bear injury, because Shuba and I were up on this hill in front of us having a meeting. Mm -hmm. And uh, we came down because we had a call out for somebody here. And I came down, and it was a fella who was being dropped off by Cal Durr. Super quiet. I, I turned around and looked up at him as he threw the patient on the ground. And I realized who it was, no but around, I just thought somebody to work, so. Yeah, this is... Uh, we might go uh, Manzanita Post, Boston Plains, uh, the Great Plains, and then Blackwater. All right, you leave. All right. Oh, are you sure it was him, Cynthia? 100%? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He didn't threaten you or anything, did he? No, he looked me dead in my eyes and then he ran away. Yeah, I bet. It's like making contact, eye contact with the devil, to be honest. Well, in his absence, we're having to deal with... We're getting a lot of visits from Mr. John Black lately. Which yep. can be frustrating. I don't think I was in any danger, though, because I, his friend needed treatment and Shuba was there with me, so. Oh, somebody's horse is here. Hello? Anybody here? Anybody need help? Hmm. Huh. We say, uh, moan, groan, make yourself known. <laughs> I hope they're all right. Maybe, maybe it's just a horse gotten lost. I don't know. Maybe. Look, we tried. Wait. Wait. What was that? <laughs> Who? Uh, hello. Who is that? Who the hell's this? 
Th this is Skyla Watt, and there is currently no call out for her. Hi, Skyla. Can you hear me, ma'am? Yo, Mrs. White. You dig the high ground. That's a great, great idea, Hinto. I, I might, uh, I might go. That might probably be a horse. I'll go grab it and bring it to her. Is she getting into her own the dog's morphine supply? We gotta be careful, she might sing, um, Happy Birthday, Mr. President, and make us all feel awkward. One thing's for sure, though, she definitely fucked Ted. Well, here I go watching Breaking Bad again. You haven't seen Breaking Bad, Zonet? It looks like she may have been hurt by a horse, which kind of checks out. I don't have any more information that to go off of, so I'm just going to treat her bruises and everything. Because uh, Skylar White is Walter White's wife in Breaking Bad. If anyone hasn't seen Breaking Bad. And if you haven't seen Breaking Bad, you need to see Breaking Bad. Everyone in the world needs mm -hmm. to give that show a go. No head injury, I think. She's just out cold. Well, Oh, dude, yeah, last few seasons, and, it gets... Uh, with a little bit of stimulant in there and see if that'll do the trick. Gets, yeah, it's, it is... A lot happens. A lot happens. Holy shit. Here comes the morphine. Ma'am, take it nice and slow. Can you hear me, Miss Swap? All right. Mrs. White may very well be in her head and may not have known what happened to her. She might just be in a catatonic state of dizziness. Should we... Should we hog tie and bring her with us for safety? I think that might scare the devil out of her. But I don't know if we have a choice. All right, well, let's hog tie her. Take her to uh, the Blackwater Doctor's Clinic and leave, leave her in there. Yeah, yeah, just get her somewhere safe inside. Hopefully she'll understand. Hey, oh, Ato, I we're gonna- I didn't mean to do that. Ato, we're gonna head out. Stop, oh, why did I kick her again? Oh, why did Whoa, you hey! Go? Leave Mrs. Mean, White alone. I didn't mean somebody else do it, please. I'm messing this up. No. <laughs> Don't drag her. Hog tie her. You just you just need a hog tie. Don't drag her. There's no easy way to doing it. I'm very sorry, Mrs. White. I'll call my horse. He is an ambulance horse doctor thing. I don't even know anymore. Get. Let your horse is wearing shoes. Yep. Don't worry, Mrs. White. We've got right. you. In the black water we go. Yeah, we'll go straight there. Ato! <laughs> oh, oh we're, we're heading straight into Blackwater. Get this uh get this lady to safety. Cougar. Oh god. Who's that running on the field? Are they alright? Hello? Are you okay? Oh, you just hunting? Yeah, but. Oh, I'm sorry. See, I'm just. No, nah, so good, boss. We were just talking about a cougar. Just want to make sure you're alright. Oh my god. Yeah, Zanak. Sons of Anarchy. Oh man. Oh, some of that was really tough. Some of those deaths were so tough. Oh my god, that's another show I love rewatching every now and again, Sons of Anarchy. So many good characters, dude. Oh my god. There's some really great scenes in that show. 
Like, on the surface, it's like, oh, it's just a dumb show about bikers. And it's like, no, no. Like, it's... There's some really good stuff in that. Really fun show. And the intro... And, like, the, the intro song's really good. Like, it's like one of those intros where it's like, nah, don't skip it. I want to hear the song again. Oh, OP! <laughs> And Bobby? No! Oh, God, no! Oh, man. Brutal. Fucking brutal, dude. Oh, that was, was messed up. That was dark. Oh, nice Hughes. Oh, go Hughes. Yeah. It's just uh, we found a uh, a lady on the road that had a uh, had a horse accident or something, so we we brought her in just to get her uh, somewhere yeah, safe. Howdy, Potter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ride in. What the hell's going on here? Yeah, we found it next to a river on by the road into town, and she she wasn't responding or anything, so we figured we'd get her out of out of there inside somewhere safe. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. Which so much she was down, like maybe she passed out. It's like maybe she got kicked by a horse or fell off it or something. Yeah, no, fresh order of uh, tea's actually gone. To we don't, we don't know. She's not responding. It's like, uh, what do you call that? Cata. Uh, but you're not one of the catastrophic. Catatonic. No. Oh no, thanks. I'm good. No, it's called catatonic. But you have to get oh, your own tea. Now. Catatonic. Catatonic, I think the delivery thing. Feeds off. But, uh, I don't, yes, I, I know what you mean. Oh, right, right. Oh, 50. But yeah, everything, everything's good down here? Yeah, it's all good down here. Oh, thank God. <sighs> what a night. Well, you, your friendly neighborhood, uh, golfs is around, George. Oh, God. Oh, God, what happened? Uh, you can talk to Mr. Harkness. Oh, what? Are you, you all right, Jack? Yeah, I'm all good. What do you have to say? Any, anything useful? I just... I just walked past him and saw him with two people. We know. He didn't say anything? No, I didn't hear him, so I walked past quite quick, so I didn't realise I spotted him. Oh, that's been... Yeah, I think you're right about Strawberry earlier. <laughs> no, I won't. Didn't I even realise. Thank, thank you, friend. That's definitely him. You got thank a good eye much. on him? Yeah, I saw him this time. Couldn't get a photo, sadly, because to me, ah, uh, nah, nah, I trust, I, I trust your eyes, Jack. You, you know him when you see him. Yeah. So what are we gonna do about it? Not much at the moment. Hey, who's this? Howdy, Potter. Uh, I do a lot right now. Oh, Rio Tinto. Howdy, uh, Potter. Yes. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Ah, oh, it's good to see you again. It's really good to see you. Uh, yes. one of the. He's been uh, riding around with Mr. Hughes. Oh, good, good, good. Uh, one of the rangers that uh, I trained up, and he's a, he's a solid ranger. Uh, he he caught folk up at YPD trying to give uh, trying to give the uh, the elders some uh, spicy cigarettes. So uh, he kicked their ass, and uh, he also dragged them through uh, some cacti as well. For <laughs> as well. Oh, I appreciate that. That's, yeah. Uh, yes. Oh, very good. Yeah. No. Who's, fantastic. What is the ranger's name? Uh, it's ranger Ranger Small Hall Miguel Miguel Small Hall. Small Hall. Oh, oh, mm -hmm. hey. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Uh, next time yeah. he's up there. Uh, actually, I met Mr. Smallhall uh, uh, last time I was up there. Good. 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 Yes, he's uh, uh, quite a quite a good man. Actually. Yes. Um, next time I will offer him the peace pipe. Yeah, he probably would hit it too with you as well. Absolutely, I think. Yeah, he, he's a, but he's a good man. Good man. Well, Very Marcus good man. Marcus would hit it with you too, but uh, you know. Well, you know. You you ah, can't yes. you you know you'd always accept that. Find your uh, Peace spirit, spirit animal up in those uh those TPs. <laughs> you, know, you know I think uh 
Well, I think we might have to make an appointment, I think. Yes, I think so. You're all welcome. <laughs> Thank you. It's good to uh, find your spirit animal. It's very you know, good. Uh, nail. Mr. Hughes here is uh, he is the wolf. Yeah, you know, I thought you might be the wolf, but... Uh, yeah, I couldn't believe it either. The signs were uh, he must trust the wolf. Holy shit. Mm. Hey, yeah, I never that's thought of it like that. That's pretty, that's pretty fucking topical. Whoa. Current. I'm definitely going to have to... Uh... You need more than just the peace pop after that one, Mark. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm, I'm going to need, like, you know, I'm, I might need to book a three-day. Um, <laughs> we, we might have to look at, you know, breakfast menu options, and, yeah, we, we might have to stay up there for a while. Mm. Mm. Maybe maybe when I get things kind of organized um, you know, on the on the east side here, and then maybe maybe uh yeah take some time okay, off and come up there. Of course. Okay, well, but Todd. Um, all right, what you what you want to do, Hughes? We we got a few deputies here at your disposal. Um, and Ranch seems like it's uh getting hit at the moment. I'd say yeah. If anyone's if anyone's up for heading back up that way, let's um. Uh... Yeah, might as well. Let's oh, get that, him that, out of there. Woodman. That's a woodman whistle. That was a woodman whistle. There it is. <laughs> I got a whistle too. Who was eating strawberry tonight? Oh, that's the thing I don't understand. That's a whistle. Um, me, me and me and uh, the marshal, we came through strawberry just uh, when we when we all kind of dispersed. Oh no, this was earlier in the night before everything went down. I'm just um I'm just being mindful of time. I may need to uh turn in for the evening I might uh I might check my telegrams and check the doctors and then I might have to turn in because I know tomorrow night's gonna be a big one with Taco Tuesday yes good old Taco Tuesday yeah, you, yes. see them po you see the poster I didn't even know where the poster was I didn't even know well, it. didn't even know that was happening I will be. Right, I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna jump go. on with one of these deputies yep. but as always right. Deputy Marshal Sheriff Wolf Eastside Westlaw great work in the night Thanks for having each other's backs and Thank you. and just keeping Thank you. at it. Appreciate yeah, everybody. You, and you too, partner. You too. You're doing fucking well out here, partner. I pre that means a lot. And, and Hinto, great to have you as always. And the yes, doctors, uh, appreciate everybody. Going to sleep, I might uh, tag along with uh, Mr. Wolf. Please do, please. Please, please, absolutely, absolutely. Oh, you had you turning in, George? See you, Doc. I might soon. Yeah, I might. I might just see the. <laughs> you know, see to my telegrams, maybe go buy some food, just see how the doctor's doing, just a few things mm -hmm. before it gets right. too late. Cause well, Dolores and Raven are over there. Oh. I think Dolores is feeling a little bit tense, so. No, I don't blame her. I don't I don't blame her. Um, what are you doing now, Miss Wheeler? Um, I, I don't know. I, I was promised excitement, but I'm glad that there isn't any, I guess. I'd, I'd say snapping turtle, but it's, again, it's just not a good time. It's it's so late. Yeah. Maybe, yeah, I'll check my telegrams. I'll go stock up on some apple lemon smoothies. You know what? You know what? Actually, you could accompany me to do. Go mm -hmm. get myself a new pump-action shotgun. All right. Well, that is presumptuous that, you know, you don't say, Hey, Cynthia, would you like to come and accompany me to get a shotgun? She's not wrong there, George. Uh, I'm kidding. Of course I'm coming with you. Do you hear, you hear yeah, his hesitation? I I have to keep him on his toes. Do people want me to be direct and make calls or not? Let's go get you a shotgun. I ain't got enough this. I'm going to be giggling about this all the way back to City Hall. <laughs> I, I yeah. am good at making people laugh. All right, I'm clocking hey, off. I'm going, I got to go get, quickly stop by the bank and then let's head out. Where, which gun store are you going to? Probably Strawberry, I think. Oh, you said that last time. Look how that turned out for you. Well, there's one there for $130, and the owner seems like a good folk. Uh, George, I'll be around. Uh, Wolf's giving me a bit of a briefing about uh, pretty much everything. So, uh, yeah. Oh, about I'm, Taco uh, Tuesday? Oh, everything. everything. Yeah. Uh, how, how much does Mr. Ains know? When I say everything, <laughs> <laughs> like probably gives. I don't want to overstep. No, never mind. I don't need. Nope. You know, I was involved, but I'm. Yeah. Nope, I'm, We're going to need. Nope. Are you going to be around tomorrow night? 
Yeah, I'll be around. Yeah. God damn it. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna probably need you when it's time for the, uh, the gentleman to go have a dr private drink. Mm -hmm. If you know what I'm saying. Yeah, I'm. I'm you got plenty of a. Uh, you got plenty of tequila. Yeah, Are you well, saying that Ames is trustworthy in this? Oh, if Wolf's told him everything. I think I find that. I find that slightly offensive. <laughs> no, well, you. If you have seen what I've seen over the last few days, you wouldn't know who you who you should be trusting. No, like, uh, from what I've I heard give, from what, Lieutenant. Should I give him a copy of the document? Is what I'm asking. Yes, you should actually. Oh, okay. I do keep some. No, I know Lieutenant spoke to Ames. I know that uh, you also share concern in everything that's going on, and you just want answers and to get to the bottom of it. I've uh, I brought things up. Here with you Lou go. Very much at the start. But yeah, I just just thinking aloud. Just yeah, I think we're gonna need a lot of tequila shots tomorrow night to uh, you know. No, what? Oh, no, you won't need to wet some tongues. You just need a single bottle. That gets him going. Fernandez told me as much. Okay, good, me. good. Fernandez told me what happened when he got drunk. He said to, they wanted, he wanted to celebrate the government. He said, a tequila shot at Beer Chaser. And when next, you know, he gives him the tequila bottle, and then he goes to give him the beer. You know, get the beers out, and the next thing he sees, fucking smile. He's just put the whole thing down. And then he drunk the beer as well. So you're not kidding. We just need one bottle, and he'll do the rest. Well, according to Fernandez. Okay, because, yeah, we're hoping then that, you know, loose lips will do some sinking of ships. Are you taking them to that secret underground bar, the nice one? That's right, yeah. So, mm. At an opportune time during the night, uh, myself, Lieutenant, maybe Frank, uh, Wolf, and most likely Ames here, we will uh, invite the uh, the governor to have a a a, a a private drink with the boys, so to speak. Of course, yeah, no, I heard your plan, but uh, if you need anything, you know, kept busy at the top side at the actual saloon, let me know. We're going to need his assistance uh, to be distracted, uh, which I think you may be able to organize something with Mr. Woodman. Uh, okay. Now, George, before I head off, uh, Wolf and I had uh, words. He told me about what happened to Jeb. Yeah. Found in the state he's been found in. Yeah, Jeb now, is on his feet today, at least. And, uh, yeah, he doesn't seem to be too great. Um, um, you know what? Let's start uh, walking off. Okay. Wait, I... Okay, yep. Has he used? No, you're up. You should see what my telegram box looks like right now. I've just gotten serious anonymous brittle threats. Really? Yeah. Uh... yeah, there's a lot. There's so much going on. This is arguably the worst week. To become you know a sheriff. What? I think this is far enough. It's just stay out here just in case. I don't. Yeah. Some certain things I don't even say in that office anymore. Now I'm. Um, George saw the poster about Mr. Gold. No. Well, I know a bit more about the Mr. Gold thing as well, at least the lead up, because Mr. Gold is who brought everything to my attention and sort of snowballed from there. Uh, he was sending me telegrams today saying that uh, he believes the same people who are out to get him are out to get me, including we had a meeting uh, yesterday, yesterday in St. Denny. Sorry, two days ago in St. Denny where he said much the same thing and that he was preparing for death and that I should prepare for it too, I guess, somehow. Now, this is my, this is, this is Marshall's sixth sense coming out, but... Uh... You got yourself a little bit of a pattern there. You got Jeb that's coming back. His head's all in a tizzy. You got uh, Gold beat to a pulp by the sounds. Well, he sounds like he... Well, he has had uh, he had shrapnel removed directly from his brain, sir. Well, it's even worse. Well, then you got your sight of your uh, friend in the, uh, you know, of, the, of the other world. Well, I'm saying the connect, but it ain't a coincidence, you ask me. So here's, here's the interesting part, is I thought Gold was missing on the Thursday night. I went up to Smi Spider Gorge, because that was where I was told that uh, that he had been taken. Turns out he was fine, but when I was up there, I was getting followed by somebody up in the mountains. That's a lot of, that's a lot of horsemen. 
Oh god. Yeah, we 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 don't exactly have the numbers to deal with this criminal no. network. No, no, no. That's a, that's a, that's yeah. understandable. The next day, Walter uh, went up with me because I couldn't shake. There was a weird feeling up there, and I couldn't shake that maybe we could find Jeb that way. As we're up there, that's when Walter started telling me everything that he knew. And then the next day, that is that same spot is exactly where Lily found Jeb. Hmm. Three days in a row, same location. And uh, interesting. And yeah, so the uh, the lineup of when Jeb went missing, insane Denny lines up when Caldera was spotted. Yeah, that's my issue. Now, the other issue I have, George, and as I said, the wolf. Um, who, who? Now, I know Jeb was the one to put the bullet in him. Did anyone stay with the body with the doctors after uh, he was... Uh, to, Dolores to did be... for a while, because William was yeah. the one who responded initially, then Dolores took over. And yeah, then when I contacted... the sheriff, though. No, no. It was Dolores and Dottie, and then Shuba was outside for most of it. Uh, we so we talked to Dolores about the death certificate as soon as the potential of the man being back from the dead thing came up. And she mm -hmm. told us that the governor had been blocking the death certificate, but then she confirmed the body was missing from the morgue. Then the day after the governor takes me across the hot coals in his office is when the death certificate showed up. All right. This you know, is, uh, you, this is not deal. You know what else has me nervous? I, I know. It was, oh, you go. I was gonna say I stayed with Mr. Billy Munda after he'd been uh, executed. I made sure that he uh, was pronounced dead. I made sure the doctors got his body. I'm just questioning why we didn't stay with that body. Make sure that it went where it needed to go. According to Dolores, she did declare him dead, which is the part that's confusing me you, uh, it's very hard to accidentally pronounce somebody did but there are rare cases when people wake up in a coffin underground there's this uh, this old thing where people used to hang bells above graves and dangle the string down into coffins so people could pull them if they were still awake mm. but very rare I don't I don't want to believe that that's the case here yeah well yeah, I don't know what's going on. I don't, I don't even speak in my office that much anymore. No, I and I, I don't blame you. Time, when I was pulled honest. into the governor's office, Dottie and her entourage were in the waiting room while I was getting talked to, which seems like a very big conflict of interest there. Mm. Yeah, well, I, mean, I, I think, George, you, you were there, I think, in St. Denis when the governor was there. Or at least Marcus was. I, For that I mean, law there, meeting? But, no, no, I wasn't. No, not that one to... A couple of days ago, this governor went over to St. Denis for some such, and I didn't even know where he was. Uh, didn't know uh, where he'd been. And, Do you uh, know about him Mark, meeting some shady-looking fella down in New Austin alone? No, uh, he hasn't told me. I don't know what his movements have been. Uh, he hasn't told me about it. Same night that he's, uh, you know, giving veiled threats here to Miss Wheeler, not long after, we bail out of town we go down to new austin to you know lay low for the night and uh outcome outcoming of the armadillo saloon drunk is the governor and then there's a fellow watching us from down the street next thing we know there's explosions down that way and then we get into cover the governor's insistent on going to a meeting with, with this guy they ride off on horseback and then we find the governor distressed up at a rascal of fork under a lot of stress he's wanting to do some soul searching the only thing he's got to hope for is Taco Tuesday. It's a fucking mess. He he wouldn't make it to Taco Tuesday. He said he'd be lucky to make it to Taco yep. Tuesday. Well, I haven't seen him for a few days. And if it's I the same man, okay. he was whispering in his ear at the law meeting the other night in St. Denis when Wolf and I were sworn in. Yeah, right. Well, actually, I did see him yesterday, but he didn't talk to me. He was uh, in his own world, so... Mm, interesting. Mm -hmm. It was, it, it's been very difficult. And uh, the way he spoke to me in the governor's office, he told me that he was trying to play God for Dottie's sake or something strange like that. Mm. Yeah. 
It's yeah. just concerning to think that we could have a compromised, you know, a leak in the government, a leak in the, the doctor's leadership, God knows what else. At this point, I trust, trust Shuba wholeheartedly, but I haven't actually had much face time in my career with Dolores, so I don't know what to make of it. Yeah. It's just concerning that she drops Shuba like a sack of shit, and next thing you know, she's cozying up to this Marcus Dunfell down here in the Blackwater Saloon, who just we've had she reports just gave me of people coming and going, about it, saying that uh, you know, who she chooses to date is her own business. But also, Walter told me yesterday that Marcus was one of the ringleaders of whoever was trying to bring him in. He said, "No, we've had reports of people." Pinkertons or deputies have seen masked men coming and going from that saloon with wagons and God knows what else. It's yeah, it Which is saloon? not Blackwater Saloon right here in town. No, it's a couple people on a wagon uh, riding out. You guys riding in? It's been gunshots going off that we can't find who the hell was doing it. It's uh interesting. There's a whole but, lot uh, of gang that... activity going on, and then there's. Then it's all coming down from the top with the governor's office. It's like Wolf and I are trying to get the two departments in sync and we're dealing with all this. It is, we are spinning so many goddamn plates. I, I've, I'm trying to keep my head down about everything, so I haven't been looking around, but. Uh, yeah, there's about four or five people near the bank uh, probably looking this way, yes. Yep. Is that, no, I'm assuming that's what you're going for. Well, how about, uh, oh, okay, we're just going to do that. I was well, going to say, oh, I'll people, be there. I think I see some rangers. I think we're good. I think I see some rangers. All right. Now, people use binoculars yeah. all the time. It's fine, no. I think. Yeah. It, uh, all right, y'all uh, stay safe. I'll, I'll be around. Uh, of course, yeah, you can. I only, you just, any... uh, I only just saw the poster for, what are you doing? Yeah. They put up for the talk of Tuesday. I don't know what the hell's going on. Yeah. Well, if you feel uh, uh, you have any questions based on the document or whatever, let me know. I put, I wrote that all down in case I die. And then you all have it written down. Well, that's a grand concern and thought, but it's well, also. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Yo, Hopi, it's, it's going really good. Yeah, Lots of story. Uh, Thank you for the follow, by the way. I'm going to my building to have a read of it, to be honest. Mm hmm. Might be uh, prudent. Yeah, actually, I'm gonna go to my, uh, I'm gonna go to my my office rather than town hall to read this. And I'll lock it up in my building. I think I will just get my new pump action shotgun, and then and then hit the hay. I think ready for yeah, tomorrow think... night. No, that's fair. All right, I'm gonna go read this and lock it in my my desk right. in my building. Y'all stay safe. And, you too. Uh, I'll see you around. See That's you tomorrow, cool. Ames. Oh, yeah. yeah. What a mess. What? Yeah. What a damn mess. Well, I've been listening ever since to keeping my head down just doing my job, so... I appreciate that. Over for me. I just want everyone to be safe. and I don't want to be afraid, but I am. You haven't gotten any more threats, like riddles, in the mail, have you? No, not, not aside from that one, except for Walter's warnings towards me. Okay. Oh, dear. I imagine... I'm a little nervous to see how Taco Tuesday goes tomorrow. Um, I am as well. I'll make sure I'll be in the area, though. In case something happens or you need help getting a distraction or anything. I imagine we'll see, you know, folk like Todd and Jack and other lawmen around, even when even when the leads go off to have that private drink. So just, you know, I, I, I just, just, just please... Just 
just we got, we got this. It'll be fine. Just, just stay safe. Just keep keep him. Oh. Yep. Whoa. Oh. All right. Howdy. Sorry. I don't think I like that. Well, I don't think they mean any harm, but that was a little bit. <laughs> Turn yeah, that, that's got me a little nervous. I'm gonna pick up the pace, I think. Alright. You know I'm gonna be fine, okay? I know, just... yeah. I know. I'm just nervous. There's gonna be a lot of, you know, the people at the saloon, the people going for the drink, and... And, you know, last time we were down in Armadillo, you know, explosions going off. Which I still don't understand that. Were they trying to distract us or something? Ah. Uh. Oh god. Just keep going. Oh god, oh god. Wait. Just, just keep going. Oh, they might need help. Whoa! What oh, the fuck? Sorry, Dr. Rules says we have to dismount early. Yeah, we better help these people. Where'd they, where'd they go? I think, I think down the road a bit. I, like, I heard it just up down here. This time I'm ready for a grizzly. I think we aren't going to get the chance. She's just running in. Hold on, wait for me. I'm oh, sorry, I didn't. I thought so you'd I'm, be able to keep up with me. I'm pacing myself. I don't want to lose my breath for when I gotta run away. Nah, I think it's that gone. Whoever it was chasing led them away. I haven't had a call for help. I don't know why I was thinking to come up this way. I. It's definitely a strange decision. I was supposed to be thinking of strawberry. My, my mistake. Don't worry, I was busy talking to you, so I forgot where you were going anyway. <laughs> Is there anything else I should be aware of, or anything that you can tell no. me? I, I can't tell you, but personal stuff, but I've told you everything that's not. Alright. I know you I know you've said you can't talk about it, but I'm concerned all the same. You know, and I really wish I could, but I don't wanna give him the satisfaction of saying that I'm a gossip or anything. I, I'm just Keep my head down. I'm gonna outperform him as a doctor. I'm gonna be the most damn professional person I can be. Yeah, try and be the bigger person. That's it. Now, I did tell him he was supposed to talk to me about medical stuff and patient care and whatnot, so the fact that he gave that information through you is kind of juvenile. Yeah, surely he saw you standing there on the porch. No, he did, and it was about a patient, so he's meant to tell me directly. Ah, oh, that's... That's disappointing. Yep. Well, he is. Well, I cannot say that. That is breaking the rules. I'm not going to say anything. I just would like you to know that what he said and did very much hurt me. I'm very sorry to hear that. I'll just be a minute. All right. I have my new down. pump action shotgun. Good. Are you I, staying in Strawberry Snap? I, 
I'm actually really enjoying staying here every night I can. The mountain air and the peace and quiet really does help a lot. It does. What are you doing? Are you heading out on duty or? No, I think I'll turn in as well. You want me to keep watch outside again? No. You can... I don't know. You can do whatever you need to do. That catch ain't too bad. I'll just check my telegram, so I'll, I'll be in there later, but, um... I do appreciate you, and I hope that you can find some moments to stress less. <laughs> we'll see how Taco Tuesday goes, and we'll go from there. You are, uh... We're gonna need to talk about getting you on some medication or something. Ah, it's... Maybe I'll just have to take up drinking again. No, I've quit drinking, so now you're not allowed to get back on it without me. Oh, God damn it! I quit drinking, I've quit cigarettes, and I'm very angry about it. That's extreme. I will see you inside. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. Alright. What a lovely lodge. Does this one open? Close enough. 